<laughs> I was getting all involved in the, the texty chat that I forgot I was supposed to be on. Hi guys, <laughs> how's it going? Uh, let me fix this. Happy Sunday! It's a very rainy, I'm gonna peek out my window. Well, it's not too rainy. It was rainier earlier. Now it's just like that, uh, like, mmm, that nice weather where it's like drizzly, and chills, or not chills, chilly. Chilly? No. Chill. Chills. <laughs> Words. Uh, hi, hi, hi. All right. Nightbot is in now, Bacon. So once you see that person join, then you can start doing the commands and everything. The best weather? Yes. It's super, super cozy weather. I love it. Just need to adjust my audios on some stuff. Also, the fall music on is probably my favorite. It is so cozy and relaxing. I absolutely love it. Mute that and ta-da! Hi, Jessica. How's it going? Oh, let's say hey to some people. Oh, thank you, Jade. You're adorable too. I love your little panda. Um, I would say that I'm a good solid uh, seven on a scale of one to ten today. Ugh. I was up really late. <laughs> I was like, a, uh, my my usual bedtime is like four o'clock in the morning now. <laughs> it is horrible. Uh, I need to get a life. <laughs> I need to get a better job. <laughs> Bartending is rough, guys. <laughs> it is. Um, chase too many mudkips in Pokemon Go today. <laughs> well, that would that would work in the rain, right? Is there's mud? There's mud outside. Rain is better than any other weather. That's part of the reason why I live in Oregon. I love, love the rain. I don't like the snow. <laughs> I like, I like my precipitation wet, not cold. <laughs> oh, hello, hello. Yes, I live in the Pacific Northwest. Um, I've lived in a lot of different places in the U.S., but the Pacific Northwest is probably my absolute favorite. Hi, Elizabeth. <gasps> Welcome in. You can't sleep early. Yeah, I, I'm a night owl. I like, I can't. Like mentally, it's just, it's hard for, my brain starts turning on into like creative mode once it hits like maybe one o'clock in the morning. And then once it starts, it's just like, okay, well, we're up. So, <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh, my Stardew Valley. No, I, I don't think I have updated it yet, Yawn. I think I saw on Twitter there was an update for it. So, no, I haven't updated it yet. I was going to do that afterwards. But um, I did launch it. It looks like everything's still running smoothly. Um, yeah. <laughs> Thanks, live. Thanks, everyone. All right. Um. Oh, I did create something. I'll show that to you guys once we get into... This stuff. Oh yeah, Murkrow. I am excited for um <laughs> I'm excited for a good spring. The I, I, I can't wait for the pollen to stop being so pollen y. <laughs> Alright, let's move this over. Click, click, click. So I, I um since we're doing expanded, I did go ahead and make a loved gift sheet. <sighs> It's a little spoiler if you haven't gotten everybody in the game yet, and I I haven't, but um, I have that now. It's linked in the description. That'll help. That'll help a lot with um, knowing what to give to people so I don't give Morris stuff when I shouldn't. Uh, I think we'll get into the game in a little bit. I just want to say hi to everyone first. Hello. Your sinuses are... Oh my gosh, yeah. Do you get... I get uh, nosebleeds when I... When I... My... My nose is uh, very sensitive and I get nosebleeds during that, but usually when it's drier. Mm -hmm. All right, so yeah, let's get into the game. Your girlfriend's from Eugene? Yeah, I haven't been to Eugene in a while. It's a little bit more south than me. I'm in the Portland area, but I think it's south. Or is it north? No, it's south. Yes, down. <laughs> um, let's get into this and then we're going to pause the music. It's going to be, what day is it? Um, I'm, 
I just launched the the thingy. Stop that. Game capture. There we go. <laughs> South thinks <thanks>, Mac. <laughs> um, I know we passed out the day before. It should be. It, it's the flower dance today. So. <laughs> Wickedy woo, the sad sap farm, yeah. Hi, Cole, how's it going? Oh, you only have six kegs and four. It takes a lot of wood and a lot of coal to get there. <laughs> For sure. Um, it's Wednesday the 24th, so it is the flower dance. Now, here's the thing. Oh my gosh. Emmer, thank you so much for the super chat. Welcome in. Hope you enjoy. Can you dance with Andy? I don't think so. You can't marry Andy, can you? Probably not. <laughs> you have to be four hearts to dance with somebody and it's the flower festival today and I'm close to Shane, but like there's no way that I can do that. Because like, I don't have anything to give to him, but. Oh yeah, we bought the frogs. Or we caught all the frogs. That that's what we were we were doing last stream, and I ended up with fourteen frogs. So that's what I'm gonna do with a um, a fish pond. I'm excited. I'm gonna turn my volume down. You guys can still hear it. Good. Oh, Navy! Thanks for joining the membership again. Oh, um, I did adjust the. I added a, an extra emote and I fixed the sandwich emote. So go ahead and check those out. The new emote that's been added is the juice box one, which I thought was cute. <laughs> I drew that one a while ago, but I finally was able to add it. And then we have the, the party, the par <laughs> me sandwich party, <laughs> my sandwich party uh, emote in there too. I was thinking of adding the dancing moving one in the, um, BTTV thing, but I'll have to get around to that later. <laughs> Yay! Okay, sorry, I'm getting distracted. You guys, you guys are distracting me. What is they doing? <laughs> Welcome in. <laughs> Thanks, mermaid. You like it? Is It's like a uh, juice box. Oh, Crazy Wolf Blood. So frogs are in the Stardew Valley Expanded, and you can catch them in the mountain area here. Uh at night time after 6 p.m. in the rain, which we just went super crazy with that yesterday. Oh, it's good luck. It's feeling a little extra lucky. Robin is not working on it today because it's a festival today, but she should be working on our coop, I do believe. And our pickaxe will be here ready tomorrow. Yeah, tomorrow. <laughs> sure thing, sure thing. Right, Navy, right. <laughs> Let's see, let's see. Queen of the sauce. Oh, it's just stir fry. Bleh. Okie dokie. Sweet. We are going and... Ooh, strawberries. Oh, I have to water everything though. I'm really happy that you guys helped me get this, um, this forest sword. That's so great. Thank you. Oh, we should probably sell some fish too. Oh, that's a bummer about today too. Like, look, I'm super broke. <laughs> I want to buy like the flower pot recipe and I would love to be able to buy like the rare crow, but I can't. <laughs> I have no money. None of the shops are open. Can I? So I can't. It's like preparation would have been really nice. I was not prepared. Am I ever though? Really? Like I like to pretend that I'm prepared, but I'm not prepared. <laughs> Wickedy fish market. <gasps> oh, that would be fun. I think. We named a frog. I don't remember what, well, I don't know which one our first one is, but we have to at least save one frog and we're gonna name them all. I don't know how we're gonna name them. Just like in our mental brains. Okay, we need that. We'll save that, we'll save that. I'm just saving some stuff for bundles. We need to save these. And we, we didn't do the remix, so it's just regular. I don't need to do the quality. We'll sell one of those. And I'm gonna save all the frogs. Yeah, I'll sa save that. I like to save my extra catfish for gifting to Willy because I love Willy. He deserves all the happiness and catfish. All the catfish. Hi Lee, welcome in. 
You usually just wing it, Panda. Yeah, I hear you. I hear you. Oh my gosh, we got build one gold. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I'm broke. <laughs> okay, so we've got all of these. Oh, I forgot. I can do this. We'll do this. Drop. Yeah, we'll do Mindsy. We'll drop some stuff off. Ooh, we got two rubies. I'll just put that in there for now. And this iridium. Oh, I got that from a fishing chest, didn't I? So this is why I want to really get that, um, the coop going. Because we get the coop going and we can upgrade it and then we can get this a dino egg in. <clears throat> we'll have all the dinosaurs forever and ever, 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 ever. Sorry. <laughs> Don't mind me. Just beating a dork again. Um, shipping bin. Shipping bin. Bloop, 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 bloop. <laughs> you plant things out, then you forget memory of a goldfish. Same. <laughs> Same. <laughs> okay, let's water some stuff. Oh, so you guys, I posted um, a picture on the Instagram in the Twitters. Man, I'm f I feel like I'm such an old person. <laughs> person like I don't know things um I got my my YouTube play button award and I'm not gonna open it on stream today I was thinking of doing like something fun so we can all do it together and like do maybe some a fun stream something a little different so a little interesting if you guys have some ideas feel free to let me know because I don't know I just play games and talk to myself and then talk to you guys and then talk to myself some more, you know. That's how I roll. Is the stream buffering? Is it having issues? Oh, I'm sorry. Da, 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 da. Hoping we don't have issues. Um... Recommend that. Okay. Well, sometimes I get little alerts from YouTube too. Um, it's hard because like it tells me on YouTube that sometimes there's issues and then sometimes it doesn't. And then my OBS says everything's looking great. So I don't know. It's weird. <laughs> okay. Maybe it's just like just for a little bit. Sorry about that. Oh, Emmer, welcome into the Cursed Coop. Be sure to check out your fun little emotes. Welcome to the party. <laughs> Oh, and I took your guys' advice and added, uh, made the alert a little bit bigger. <laughs> a little bit bigger. Oh, I need to water these so we can go to the festival. Like, even though I can't afford anything at this festival, I still think that we should, uh, where are we putting our strawberries? Crops and seeds, right? Yeah. I still think we should go. Like, what if there's something different? What if there's something new? What if I can dance with Andy? I don't want to, but like... Maybe. You can't marry Andy, can you? <gasps> Ooh, do I have my... Yes, I do. <laughs> I forgot if I put my uh, auto hot keys back on. <laughs> do, 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 do. <laughs> so cute in the middle of the screen. Yeah. <laughs> I still haven't added any variations to it yet. But I'll get there. Get there. I want to do some Junimo stuff. I think that would be really fun. Boop, boop. Water, 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 water. This is my life now. <laughs> uh, what time does the festival start? I think we have until 2 o'clock to get there. Should be. Hey, cat. Hey, sticky. Sticky kitty. <laughs> Yeah, it does help with the friendships. You get, um, I think it's the same as t for, like, talking. It's not a special amount of number. Um, so if you talk to somebody a day, it gives you, like, 25 relationship points. I don't think that festivals give you more than that, but I could be wrong. I don't remember. I know that you get extra if you dance with someone. That boosts you up quite a bit, like 150 points or something like that. Which can be super great. Duh. 
My least favorite festival in Stardew? Uh, that's a tough one. Uh, hmm. Probably, honestly, probably the flower dance. <laughs> it's probably this one because, like, I always go to it on the first year and I just feel so awkward. I never, I'm, I never focus on relationships until I feel like my farm is really well established normally when I play. And so I just feel like, what's the point of me being here? It's like me with like a regular dance. Why am I here? <laughs> yeah, I do have animation canceling on right now. Oh yeah, I I was uh I didn't watch the theories part for Leap a lot. I was there during the the battles. <laughs> during the battles. That was fun. I still think like Jazz winning was great. Or Jazz being super creepy is awesome. I'm glad that he liked my uh Jody with the towel whips <laughs> theory. <laughs> Yeah, um, the the flower dance is good if you have the money for um, the rare crow, which I think is like two thousand gold or a thousand gold. It's one of the one or the other. It's more than I have, that's for sure. But um, it's needed for you to be able to get the deluxe rare crow eventually, and you can get the deluxe rare crow in one year if you uh, try. You could get it by the. Um, the day after the Spirit's Eve, because that's the last one in game that you can get. You can buy everything else beforehand or get to the casino and stuff and get those. But um, yeah, that's the last one that you can get in game time. We're going to have to eat these salmon berries. But that's if you remember to save enough money for, <laughs> for the flower festival one. <laughs> that, that's my problem. Hello, hello. I think the Luau boost, yeah, um, the Luau boost friendships a lot if you get something good in the pot. That's usually what I use to boost a lot of friendships at the beginning of a game. Let's go ahead and drop this stuff off. Let's go to resources, drop that off. And then I guess we'll go. I wonder if it looks different, like I'm excited. Um, this mod, we have Stardew Valley Expanded. Ooh. Plus quite a few different other things, too. I've listed them all in the description. Oh, there's this little bridge. It's like a, a trail. That's different. So this is going to be a little, little bit different. Oh, everyone's going to be in their cute little, little dresses. And look, Elliot's little flower in his hair. Ah, dying. You can't talk to Pierre, which is a bummer. <laughs> See, look, I'm broke. I don't have the thousand for that. Twenty five hundred. That's how much it is. Oh goodness, that would be that would be smart. But <laughs> love the bigger bridge. Yeah, is it possible to dance with someone except Shane or Haley? Um, it depends. Uh, yes, it depends on if you have quests quests with them on the the board. Um. If you finish out like a, a request for somebody, that helps boost up friendship. It also depends on like if you were to get to Calico Desert for some reason before the Flower Festival, you could get like um, some other things that other people love, like um, cactus for um, Sam. You could always buy salads and give those to Leah, things like that. There is ways to it. Do it. It just takes a little bit more effort. But the don't no don't ask her that. Uh, the easiest way is if um if you get something on the board uh, for somebody. I think I was able to dance with Maru one time before the flower festival because I had a gold star cauliflower and I gave that to her. And she requested two different things on the board too, which was awesome. Oh, I know. It would be nice if our, our outfit uh, could change. You can make something pretty nice. The shirt I think that fits best with this is um, 
you can craft a little shirt for for the girl shirt um or for a more feminine shirt is you can craft a shirt with a spring onion and that looks pretty that's pretty good i'm just gonna talk to everybody even though i don't want to like dance i'm not gonna dance with anybody boo Ooh, maru looks so pretty we should look at all their faces oh linus <laughs> yay look at linus do you want to dance, Linus? <laughs> uh. Yeah. <laughs> Doctor loves coffee. Oh my gosh. Yes, that would be easy too. Um, I don't know, Rick. I've I've never really danced with uh, other people. <laughs> Always in the corner. You're running. That's me. <laughs> uh, look at Maru, or not Maru, <laughs> Marnie. Love is in the air and I'm still single. Same girl, same. <laughs> hey, Marlin. Wait, is the wizard, the wizard isn't here today, is he? Haley's got her little flower crown. All of these outfits are so cute. Been loving it. Just, <laughs> Alex, you're so creepy. Look at Lewis. He took his hat off. No. Hey, Andy. I found some leaks during our walkover. Nothing like some ale with a leak. Oh, I can't ask him to dance. I was wondering. <laughs> Looks like we can't marry Andy. It's fine. Linus the flower queen. Linus, yes. Yes, yes. Like, his little sprite looks so cute, too. Like, look at that. I would love to dance with Linus. Oh, Evelyn looks so cute. Wait, where's George? Is George a plant? Is George not here? Oh no, there he is. How did I not? I thought she was standing next to the plant. And I thought George was the plant. I don't know why I thought that. I mean, he's pretty planted in the ground, I guess. But <laughs> never mind. Uh, the wizard does. Goes up top. Okay. There he is. Hey, Raz. Come here. Talk to me. Talk to me. <laughs> Dance with me. This green stuff is spicy. Much, much. Ooh. Abigail has a little choker on. That's kind of cute. It's so embarrassing. Yes, agreed. That's all he has to say is just ugh. <laughs> Sebastian probably has like a hangover or something. Yeah, Shane looks like thinner, you know. <laughs> I would do that. I would totally do that. But like, Raz, get down here. I got to dance with you. We've got dancing to do. It's parties and stuff. Pam is looking uh that eyeshadow, man. Gus looks good. Um, the only thing I don't like about the the change to like Gus is Sprite. Like he doesn't have his little tongue sticking out anymore. That's always how I imagined it. It's just like a little cat with his tongue sticking out. And now it's not sticking out anymore, so he's not going bleh, you know. <laughs> Willie looks so weird without his hat on. Oh my gosh. And then here is our, our newbie, little Sophia. How old Sebastian? Um, I'd say he's like 21, 22, something like that. I don't know. Between the ages of 19 and 23, in that time frame. And depending on what country this is in, 19 is the drinking age. So, <laughs> I don't know. Hey, Victor, strawberry jello is truly remarkable. Oh, he's looking all the way over at that strawberry jello. Maybe he's like checking out Shane or something. <gasps> Look at Robin. She looks so pretty. Look at her little hair. She's looking great. Olivia, uh, great opportunity to talk to Caroline and Jody. Okay, cool. Ooh, Caroline does not look happy. Look at her. <laughs> look at her face. She's like. <laughs> gosh I don't think she has a very happy marriage but that's just me personally <laughs> oh hey soft how's it going 
Um, a few different mods work with Stardew Valley Expanded. I've listed the ones that I have, but um, a lot of people like the Ridgeside Village and the... Oh, what's it called? Scarp? There's a couple of different like cities and stuff that you can add. It just like expands it like tenfold. It's huge. A little overwhelming for me, so I don't think I could do that for a while. Robin should dress up way more. Yeah, you should see Robin in the, um, if you haven't, Emily has a heart event and Robin changes her outfit. She looks really pretty. Oh, Jody, no, that eyeshadow does not work for your complexion. That's just my opinion. <laughs> Uh, these springtime dances can be traced back to ancient fertility. Okay. Way to make it awkward, Demetrius. <laughs> oh, look at Elliot. Wore my best shirt for this dance. This sort of thing doesn't happen very often. Oh, he's special. <laughs> you always wanted to romance Caroline. Wouldn't that be great? Like, just being able to break people up destroy their hopes and dreams and then give them better hopes and dreams. <laughs> Lily Moncat, thank you so much for the super chat. I am excited um, about Rasmodius being uh, dateable, but yeah, it would be super great if you could actually dance with him. I mean, not that we would be able to. I'm not at four hearts with anybody right now. I think I haven't talked to these children. <gasps> Look at little Fitz and his little Sorry, his little hair just looks, he's like tried really hard to brush it or his mom probably tried really hard to brush it to the side and it looks all like he's all dapper, but he's got the cat look in the back. <laughs> There's no fixing that, but he's so cute. Oh, dying. Hey, creepy Jazz, look at her. She's terrifying. <laughs> She's good. That sounds like a threat. <laughs> Sorry. Leah, yes, she looks, they all look super good, but now I can't talk to them anymore. Um, who have I not talked to? Rasmodius. Claire, she's not here today. Wait, she is here today? Look, it shows her in her little outfit. I didn't see her. Did you guys see her? Claire, Claire, Claire. No, I don't see her anywhere. That's weird. That's weird. It gives her, uh, like, a little outfit, but I don't see her anywhere. Maybe she's a plant. <laughs> Anyways, who have I not talked to? Claire and Morris isn't here. Or Pierre or Martin. I can't talk to Pierre, so. Oh, well. Vince is super adorable. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. Elijah. Yes. I am having like they're too old to dress up anymore <laughs> well I guess I could always dress up my 15 year old if he lets me he likes cool hats so I'll just I'll just get him a bunch of cool hats well I can't dance with anyone I like their dresses I guess we'll just watch everybody like I don't want to get rejected wait we should get rejected who should reject us <laughs> Is is she at the table? Oh, I don't think so. That's Sophia. Claire has red hair. And it's tied back in a little bun, so I don't see her anywhere. Oh, she doesn't come to festivals until I say Oh, okay. That's why she has an outfit. Thanks, Tatiana. That helps. You want me to have Victor? <laughs> Victor reject me. Let's have everybody reject me. Uh, oh, okay. Here. Sorry, I don't really dance. Oh. Okay, let's ask, um... Let's ask Penny. That way I can look at their face again. Oh, she looks so sad. Will you dance with me? No. Oh, let's ask Maru again. I wanted to look at her face again. I'm flattered, but no. Oh. <laughs> Ellie's response is rude. <laughs> is Ellie a joke? I don't know. I never ask anybody to dance with me. Excuse me. Not <laughs> oh my gosh. Rude. Hey, how about Leah? Leah. 
I'll be honest, I don't want to dance with you. At least she's honest. Like... <laughs> I'm sad. <laughs> no, I don't want to ask you. I'm not even going to bother. <laughs> Sorry. Sam's fine. He just seems so young. Maybe next year. Uh, No. There's someone else. Up. Oh! Who is it? He wants to dance with Sam or Abigail. Hmm. I'm just going to get rejected by everybody today. At least it's always rude. <laughs> I don't know. There might be a um a mod for like different older people and stuff. Oh, I'm not a I'm not high enough hearts with Haley. I'm only at um three hearts with Shane. Now nah, I'm gonna ask someone else. Good luck. Okay, cool. Um, Haley's been flower queen for the last five years. Uh, you know. <laughs> That's the worst feeling ever. Like, you're like, you put yourself out there. You're like, what's up, girl? And they're just like, ew. <laughs> Jerk. I'm crying. Okay, I think I've asked everybody. I think I've been rejected by enough people. Let's finish this day. <laughs> yeah, let's start. Hi, Emmy. How's it going? <laughs> At least she's honest with not liking us. <gasps> they have little Linus. Look at creepy Jess. Yeah, she's blunt, so I'll give her that. <laughs> all of their suits are a little bit different. That's nice. I like all of their outfits. Abigail's got a little bit of green going on. Um, I think Haley's looks pretty classic, like classic style. I like Maru's a lot. I like Emily's a lot too. I think that's really cute. Eight Hearts of Ellie, it still sells, says it's chilly when I'm around. <laughs> His heart's cold when I'm around. All right, it's 10 o'clock. What am I going to do with the rest of my day? Um, I'm out of energy. Yeah, it's normal. Um, da, 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 da. frogs. Have I finished? I have not finished the boiler room yet. Okay, so we need to get some stuff. That was like our focus, right? We wanted to get all of the boiler room stuff done. So let's go ahead and open up the Minesy box so I can see where we're at with that. I have, I just need a gold bar. Okay, well, my pickaxe is gone right now, so I guess I'll just chop some trees until bedtime. We're not going to level up today, which is fine. Eating fish? Oh, that sounds good too. <laughs> I've been getting that much rejection from- Oh no, <laughs> Annie, I'm sorry. That's the worst. Well. I accept you. Oh, we can check the cave too. I haven't checked the cave yet. Not today. Well, I do need to like clear up some space and stuff. These little trees are, are trucking right along. They're gonna be looking great. Uh, go this way. Uh, a plum. I'll just leave it there. We're gonna leave it there for a little bit. And then... Oh. Hello. A little cat. We'll just chop this tree. I don't really have, like, a lot of time. I don't know what the fish are like on this farm. Um, they're probably just, like, basic fish, but none of them are gonna be very high, um, zones. So I might just be getting, like, a whole bunch of trash. Which, I mean, I'm not opposed to trash. Y'all know me. I love my trash, but... Ooh, let's, um... Let's chop this stump. That'll be fun. Chop that tree. <laughs> and oh my gosh, I cannot believe we're almost out of salmon berries. This is what happens when you don't prepare, you guys. It's good to <laughs> take your own advice. Like, I literally made a tips video about foraging and getting your foraging up so that you don't run out of salmon berries before the end of summer. <laughs> 
I don't take my own advice. <laughs> Oops. What am I doing? That's okay. We'll get a ton of money soon. I'll probably just buy a bunch of salads or whatever. I know, Mac. I know. <laughs> I did this to myself. I'm not being a very good example. You can never take your I know. <laughs> oh, I was wondering. So when you hit level eight in foraging, you can start getting three. Oh, we should just go to bed. I don't have a level up. We should go to bed. Um, you can start getting three berries from a bush, right? And I usually get that by the time it's um, blackberry season, which is super great. But I was wondering if there was a way to get to it by before salmonberry season. I think the highest I've ever been able to get um, before salmonberry season was like level six or something. Oh, Daniel, thank you so much for the super chat. Welcome in. I hope your Sunday is doing super great. Hmm. Hi, Dark Geo. Welcome in. Hi, Nicole. Ooh, I like your last name. Scharfenberg. I think I said it right. What is our foraging at? Our foraging at is at... We would need 128 trees, or not trees, experience points. 128 experience points, which is about 10 trees to level up. So I don't have enough. This is like uh, 13, 13 experience points for a tree if you include the stump. So I was wondering if it's possible to get to level eight foraging before salmonberry season. I don't know, that would be a lot of cheap tree shopping and a lot of forage harvesting. All right, we're going to bed and I'm not passing out, so it's a good day. <laughs> um, Live unboxing, I'm coming up with probably sometime this week. I'm going to be coming up with uh, something for something fun to do on stream that isn't just the uh, playthrough that we're doing. But it's like, I have it right over here. Hold on. It's right here. I have it. It's ready. The tape is still sealed. I haven't opened it myself, so it's still it's here. And I like I have it set on my bed my bedside and I've been looking at it and I'm like, yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Just ignore me. <sighs> Just ignore me. Well, I mean, I guess that's not why you're here. You're not here to ignore me. Uh, it's actually not very heavy at all. I mean, it's it's weighted down with a lot of, like, blood, sweat, and tears. But apart from that, it's not very heavy at all. <laughs> all right. Oh, what was that? Was that for the coop? I think that was the noise for the coop. Oh, if that's the case, I'm going to be able to buy some chickens. Yes. And then we need to sell some more stuff so we can get some more money so that we can upgrade it again. <laughs> what? Yes. <laughs> Journal updated. Raisin chickens. Yeah. Weather report. Oh, so it is Thursday, so Marnie should be there today. <laughs> oh, would like to hope. I'd like to hope so. Who knows? Who knows? We've got some strawberry jelly. Oh! I was checking your sh- okay. Creeper. Pierre and Sophia had a large number of products to ship this morning. I wonder if he comes by with like a little cart or if he like has magic pockets that just everything fits inside or maybe, I don't know, how does he like, what if the shipping bin is connected to an underground 
like tunnel system and inside is little tunnels and that's what happened to the junimos the junimos are trying to break free through the community center but underneath the, the ground lewis has all of the junimos trapped down there and working to process everything and to ship them out so it's just like a giant shipping mail room where he sends everything places i don't know just ignore <laughs> the theories <laughs> oh Hi, patients. Hello. <laughs> uh, I'm very happy you're getting situated here in Stardew Valley and you're making great progress on the sad sap farm. <laughs> uh. Oh, I've got so many conspiracy theories. <laughs> but I usually just make them up as I go. Uh, I don't write any of these things down. I probably should. <laughs> I need to walk over to Fairhaven Farm and check if Andy is shipping anything. He usually has high quality forage from Cindersap Forest. Okay. Must be convenient to be able to forage in your backyard. Okay. I'll leave. Oh, did you just come by for a little chat? Go to work, Lewis. Jeez, what are you even doing? Huh. I do like cookies. Snickerdoodles are my favorite cookie. In case you were curious, Snicker Snickerdoodles it is. I like the softer cookies, not the crunchy cookies. Um, come by the shop and check out the new rods. Oh yeah, Willie's got some rods, uh, some new rods. <laughs> um, okay, so we can either build a fish pond next, cause I can make I can whip up some money real quick now that we can sell directly to someone. So we can either do a fish pond, or I can try and upgrade the coop so that we can. Oh, how much does it cost to upgrade a coop again? I forget. Upgrade coop buildings. Do 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 ten thousand gold to upgrade a coop, which would be twenty tea saplings for ten thousand gold, I think. Yes. Yeah. If I can make twenty tea saplings I can do that, but then I won't have enough wood. We could do that or I could do a fish pond. What do you guys think? Fish pond or coop upgrade is our next one. I also think that I might be hitting level six of farming here soon with these strawberries, which is pretty great. Oh, hey, Shania, welcome in. You love snickerdoodles? Mm, so good. I've actually never made snickerdoodles. I just eat them. I don't think I'd be able to make them because like putting all that dusting of cinnamon sugar sounds like a real mess. <laughs> you think coops fishes? Ooh. Four coops so far. Ooh, two fishes. I guess I get it. You guys like the poles, right? Next Robin thing. Upgrade or pond. So with the coop upgrade, we can do um, get that dino egg in there, which would be super great. And then I could get some ducks, man. But we'd have to move the... I don't know why I say it like that. I think there were some clips that was like chicks, man, or something like that. And it just stuck in my head. And now that's how I say ducks. <laughs> um, we could do ducks. I'd move my coop closer to some water. So maybe the ducks like did some like splishy, splashy stuff. You know, like ducks do. That's what they do. And then that would be cool. Or we could get into um, getting a fish pond. But I already have some frogs, so we're okay a little bit. Yay, level six. We're going to make sprinklers, ugh, sprinklers soon. It's looking like Coop is winning. Oh, hey, Sarah. Welcome in. Welcome in. Is that water for me drinking water? Mmm. Is that how you do it, Sparkle? Shake and bake it? Yeah. That sounds good. I think I, sh I should do that. Well, I have over 50 votes, so it's looking like Coop Upgrade it is. So I'm going to muster up. <laughs> That's how you say it. I've got to wrestle up 10,000 gold. And then we got to buy some chickens. Strawberries. That's totally fine. I can absolutely come up with some money. Um, I don't think I want to sell strawberries. And then overnight, I'm going to be able to build 
spring like I can't be the only one who doesn't make the regular sprinklers, right? You guys, do you guys think that like it's a waste of resources? I feel like it's a waste of resources. I like wait until the quality sprinkler is available and then I use that. <laughs> Mustard up. <laughs> That's a cool. <laughs> yes, that. Exactly. Oh, you want a strawberry? I don't know if you're allergic. You can't have it. <laughs> it's mine. Uh, maybe I'll sell the, the gold star strawberries for some money. The nice thing about the mod that I have is I can see how much money it is. But I think that tea saplings should be just fine, depending on how much fiber I have. You didn't use sprinklers until year three. Ooh. I'm sorry. <laughs> Although some people really love just watering, and that that's totally fine. But it's really hard to scale up without sprinklers, I think. Boop. Boop, boop, boop. I am ready for some sprinklers. And if I wanted to, we could make some like money and buy sprinklers for 4,000 gold apiece, which is also like good. But if we're trying to get that coop upgrade, that's what we want to focus on first. Do I want to replant these forage though? That's a question. Once you go automated though, it's hard to go back. Yeah, that's why I haven't up I haven't added the automated thing in yet. <laughs> because I feel like a Oh gosh, I, of course I did an invalid link again. Jeez. Jeez. Why? Invite people. Edit invite. I swear. Never expire, please. Please, max number of uses, no limit. <laughs> I swear. This is going to be a running theme. <laughs> of me always 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 having issues with my discord link you guys <laughs> and then let me edit in nightbot edit it in the nightbot duh, 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 duh. submit and there we go that should be good now <laughs> it's always little things i know right um my favorite mod from this so far is um, well, Stardew Valley Expanded just obviously like adds so much stuff, but my favorite mod of all time is UI Info Suite. It's just so great. It's the thing that kind of adds like when I mouse over, it tells me when things are done. It um, tells me how things, how much things sell for. It's just like it adds all these little things into everything. Just a little bit of more information. I'm an information junkie. I love knowing what's going on with everything and so that's always been my favorite mod um i've never i've only done cross-country skiing one time i've never really gone skiing or snowboarding but i'm not really a snow person or snow bunny all right last two salmon berries There, now there's the Discord link. Okay. I swear. Issues. Uh, I don't like that the music is gone. Da, da, da. Sprinkle is very good. You can invest your time to go. Yeah, exactly. That's the nice thing about sprinklers is that it gives you more time to do everything else. I, that's why I love getting it if I can before summer or by the first of summer. So my summertime is just like spent fishing or mining or hitting skull cavern if I get that far. Do, 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 do. Watering is my life now. <laughs> You have to sing the soundtrack now. <laughs> Sorry, I'm reading. You just got an ancient seed on your first day? What? Soft? Oh my gosh, that's amazing. Now, let's hope that you get a, a crop fairy. That would be pretty awesome. 
and have the crop fairy hit the ancient seed. That would be pretty baller. All right, there's some music. Let's do um some move to the forage. Drop everything off. I'm going to make a few seed packets with these. We're just gonna go all seeds because I I know I'll use those for something. A nice thing is is like I could just sell the seed packets if I can't make uh, tea saplings with it. And then we'll replant. <laughs> what I'm gonna call the chickens? Oh my gosh, I can't even I can't even think about that. You guys can help me name my chickens. <laughs> they gotta be related to whatever is going on here. Maybe like everything is named after some sort of sauce. What do you think? Like maple syrup or um Ooh, chickens could be named like some sort of aioli, right? Because aioli and, and mayonnaise and stuff are made from eggs. Let's go to resources. Oh, I don't have much wood or... Yeah. <laughs> 10. Okay. 15 is how much money? How much money is that? That's 7,500 gold? Cool, cool, cool. And then I have 2,000 right now. And then there's 870. And then I have to buy a bunch of wood. So I need to, I can only make two more. That's all the wood that I have. I need to find money. And then we're gonna have to do some foraging for like fiber, fiber seeds and finding and stuff. And I'll probably find fiber like all over the place. So I just like have it. It is the 25th day of the sp sprig. No, of the spring. <laughs> I can't read that. Uh. Oh, they won't. You guys are so right. I usually pay attention to the time and we just wasted however many seeds. It's totally fine. You know what? What we did was be smart, right? We're going to turn this around into a way that makes me feel like I'm a smart person. I was being smart. I don't want to hoe that on the first day of summer. So what I did was waste a bunch of money, put the seeds in the ground so that I cannot hoe it in the summer. And we'll just cut some plants. That, that's, what, that's totally what I did. It was intentional. <laughs> Oh my gosh. Mm. Yep. <laughs> Oops. All right, Daniel, thank you so much for the super chat. You have a good rest of your day too. Hey, Dark, if I can make it work for me, I will. I will. <laughs> All right, let's go ahead and make this. Um, I've got a bunch of seeds. I have some that will be like finished growing. We have some that'll finish growing. I can sell these too for 1800, but it would be better to sell them as like tea saplings. I wonder if I can come up with, it's 1230. I mean, there's some fiber around. Every five fiber is 500 gold for me. So I could chop some, break some stuff. I just need, I just need some money, honey. See, there's like three more tea saplings right there. Now we just need 15 wood. If I can grab my wood axe. Wood axe, resources, grab that. Yeah, smart. <laughs> the seeds are free though, yeah. Just, it was just like potential money that I could have made. How many was that? Eight, nine, 10. Eight times three is more than 16. <laughs> 16, 17, 18, 19. 24 plus 9. So that was like 33 seeds right there, which would have been money. <laughs> 33 times 30. They sell for 35 gold a piece. So it's like 1155 money. <laughs> Oops. Oh, bye, Rick. Have a good one. Yeah, and he's always good to find the positive. <laughs> my, all my money? I don't know. Gone forever. 
I spent it on upgrade or building a coop, I think. It's two o'clock. I gotta get going if I want to build some stuff. I don't think I'm gonna be able to get to chickens. Oh man, I wish I had coffee. I can make a total of three more saplings. Okay, so there's 20. That is 10,000 gold. That's enough to make the coop. I don't have enough wood for it, but we'll bring the wood with us because I might be able to make some money. I'm selling some other stuff. Let's go ahead and bring the strawberries with us. Like the gold star ones. Well, I'm going to leave four. Gold star ones are loved by both Demetrius and Maru, so I like to save a few of those. But the other strawberries I, I use for other things. So what I'm going to do is go buy chickens first because Marnie closes first. Then we're going to maybe be able to make it to Pierre, sell all this stuff. And if that's the case, then we need to go and go to... Robins to directly after that. Um, it's 150 stone to upgrade the coop. So might be able to make it. Might not. I don't know. We'll see. I don't have my pickaxe yet. We might be able to pick that up today. If not, I'll have to pick it up tomorrow. If you stick with the plan, it's easier to fail. <laughs> no, it's not. Hey, give me chickens. <laughs> Okay, we're gonna give chickens. And you guys got any um any suggestions for chicken names? I don't have a poll. We're just gonna like do chickens. I need one of each. So we're gonna get two chickens, one brown chicken. And then we're gonna get a white chicken too, so we can have one of each egg. I won't leave usually midstream you have to plug your phone in. <laughs> yeah. Uh, me too. Oh, thanks, Gypsy. Have a good night. Get some good sleep. Oh, Nugget, Nuggy. You guys are like on the same page with that Kung Pao deviled egg. Cupie. Oh, poutine is delicious. Here, okay. I'm going to choose the first couple and then, um, then, uh, buh, 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 buh. you guys can choose. And then the first winner is the first chicken and then the second place is the second chicken we have nugget nuggy we're just doing the first four um oh my gosh you guys got a lot of names i might save those for other things i think we'll do nuggy instead of nugget yeah i think that's a good first one and then Kung Pao, I like <laughs> Mr. Messy Sauce, uh, Great Poop Pod, oh my gosh, I like Quiche, but I, I name, I tend to name my chickens Quiche like all the time, uh, that, that's my usual name is like um, anything that's a type of chicken dish or uh, egg dish. I name all of my animals after after um, foods. There, there's a few. You guys can vote on those ones. Da, 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 da. Ooh, tamago. Ooh, that's a good dish. You're only thinking of aiolis. <laughs> aioli is a good. It's just a weird. It's a good word, but it's a weird word, right? Aoli. It looks like Cupy is winning so far. Oh, Nuggies. Nuggies pulling in the lead. <laughs> Hi, Scenic Route. How's it going? You're lazy. You just give them random names. Yeah, I do that sometimes too. Like, if I'm just playing something to play it. I think the first chicken is going to be Nuggy. And then we got to see because we're really close on. Uh, the second name. So Nuggy for our first chicken. And then come on, white chicken. White chicken. There we go. Do 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 do. Yeah, I like uh I have I think I have cordon blue somewhere. In one of my farms. <laughs> 
All right, it's been a toss up between Cupy and Chickpea, and I'm just gonna choose the one I like more. I like them both, but I think I'll use Chickpea in another one. So we're gonna do Coopy. <laughs> it's like Coopy, but Q, right? <laughs> All right, 69 voice votes, that's very nice. <laughs> Maybe I'll be able to remember the names for next time. Okay, so that's that. We gotta go, oh, she got a little chicken statue in there. That's cute. <laughs> that's uh, Let's see if we can sell this to, oh, do I wanna pick up my pickaxe first? It's three o'clock. Okay, I've got, oh, what's going on? <gasps> Andy, as I said before, you can't ignore. No, you lose it, what a tarnation. <laughs> What? I love it when people say what in tarnation. I don't know. It just gets me. What in tarnation is that supposed to mean? Don't come telling me oh more. I'm doing just fine with Fairhaven Farm. Don't you go tell me this bad news. It's out of my hands. The Ferngill government adjusted it to... Oh my gosh. Lewis, jeez. Jeez, Lewis, I thought this valley supported local farmers. Ooh, goodness. The mayor of Gra Grambleton isn't happy with this either. I'm in no way trying to... No, the answer is no. I can barely afford my seeds for new harvests. I can't afford this at all. Oh, he's causing a huge, huge scene. Andy, everything will be okay. I'm going to divert funds from the fest... I don't need no one's help. I don't accept handouts. I'll figure something out. Wow. I think he has I think he has some anger problems. Just a little bit, guys. Maybe. <laughs> he joined the stream in the middle of cutscene. Sorry, here. <laughs> Seems like a conversation that would be done in yeah. Yeah, it's a perfect conversation in the middle of the town square. Like, all of my best uncomfortable conversations happen here. <laughs> this conversation is over! I'm leaving! Are you sure? <laughs> I thought he was gonna, like, push past me. <sighs> Drama! <laughs> oh, you did tell me you was scary, huh? Does kind of, like I want him to be my friend but also like yeah he's got some rage he's got some rage issues uh, it's kind of hard not to hear that Lewis jeez new regulations I don't think they understand the negative impact it's having on small communities I never get taxed for anything I wonder I tried negotiating, but they wouldn't listen to me. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Tried. I guess Andy's not doing so good. I was a new face. Kendra and I are drafting an elaborate proposal. I don't think it should be that elaborate. You should just, like, simplify it to make it really easy for everybody. Uh, I'll check on him. Oh, Lavender, I'm doing good. How are you? <laughs> sad sad farm doesn't pay taxes yeah <laughs> oh speaking of i've got to pay my taxes <laughs> i think i've paid it maybe i don't know i have to check thanks this is most appreciated i don't know kendra is somebody maybe he's like lewis's other side piece i don't know I'm going to start on that draft now. Have a nice day, Wicked Woo. I don't know if I've met a Kendra yet. I know, Mac. I know. Oh, another scene. You forgot about your own vanilla Stardew Valley scene. Gotta water the cat. <laughs> it's a lovely day today. I dropped by to check on my green beans and the ready harvest. Ooh, can I have some? I like this. This scarecrow has like a little blue outfit. She's cute. Community is pretty nifty. Oh, Leah. 
Why you gotta say stuff like that? I love you now. I love when people say weird words. I, I guess nifty isn't really like a weird word, but it's one that people don't say anymore, except for like, it, it always sounds like a granny word, you know? I don't know. I like it. <laughs> it's like me. <laughs> Another side. <laughs> Uh, community garden is a neat idea. It's cute. It's cute, but my farm can hold 40 times more. <laughs> okay. It's like... Mm, that's me trying to compensate for something. We're just gonna go with the... It's a cute idea. It's spectacular. I like Leah. I haven't married Leah in a long time. Should marry Leah again. I don't have much property to grow my own food. But thanks to this little plot of land, we all share a can. Oh, that's nice. That's all of them. Now I need to decide what to cook with these tonight. Ooh, do a um a black bean like garlic green bean dish. So good. It's my favorite favorite dish from Chinese takeout. I don't need the chicken in it, just the green beans. Like, oh. Yum. So good. Oh, Thanks. Can I sell it? Oh, I eat it right away. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> uh, Sierra, it's always Krobus. Krobus is my heart and my life and my everything. Oh, I ate it and I get to keep it. Nice. I love Krobus so much, but if it wasn't Krobus, um, that's a tough one. I'm going to see if I can get to, hold on. See if I can get to Clint's real quick before four o'clock, pick up my pickaxe, and then as I take a little detour to check the trashes, and then run to Pierre's real quick, um, sell some stuff, and see if we can dash to Robin's. Uh, probably not. I don't have the, the mine carts just yet, but take that. Get red right out. Get red right out. You got one cent. I owe money this year. <laughs> the thing about uh, being a an online creator unless you set aside money for taxes like quarterly or set something up then it's um you have to pay taxes it's my first time owing money <laughs> first time okay it is thursday good we're just gonna check the board real quick get a cave carrot to linus yes ah. all right sell strawberry jelly sell tea saplings yeah money and is that going to be enough money to buy? So we need wood too. I'll just sell these strawberries just so I'm I'm covered. That should be enough money to buy all the wood and stone that I need, right? 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 Okay. We have 10,000 gold we need. We need 400 wood and 150. So I have to buy 50 uh, th about 355 wood and 50 stone, Kai. So. Stone is 20 bucks right now. So that's going to be a thousand in stone. Oh. Is it 20? Oh, yeah, it's 20 bucks. And then 355 times 10. No, I don't, I don't have enough. <laughs> I don't have enough money. <laughs> Um, maybe if I add this to it, hold on, Psh, mathing, minus, where's my history? Um, it was 10 gold times 355 for wood. Plus my, sorry, I have my calculator on my screen. Plus 1155. 1155 equals minus 2686. Okay, so I need to come up with 2020 more gold, and I don't think that that's enough. Nope, we're going to be short by like 500, 400. If I was to sell this and my parsnips, which I've been using for eating, I would have just enough. So I'm going to go ahead and do that. Boop, boop. And this green bean <laughs> just to be sure <laughs> let's see if that works and if not if not oh well 
I can, I'm sure I'll be able to make those seeds, more seeds later. I'm gonna pick those up as I come back. I wanna get to Robin's first before she's out. I know, everything's so expensive. It's worse, like, I can't buy wood in the second year. It just feels, like, wrong. Thank goodness it's Thursday, not Friday. On Friday, she leaves the shop just a little early. Okay, so we're gonna shop first, and we'll start with the wood. Yeah, okay. Two hundred, and I need four hundred. Okay, that Cordy dude, thank you for stopping in. Oh, thanks, Lavender. Oh, I have a new uh, sheet, which I listed in the description, too. It's the loved gift sheet for um, Stardew Valley Expanded. That took a lot of time to make. And we just need a hundred more. Boop, boop. Okay, can we get it? Yes. One, two. Fifteen. We need one fifty. Five, ten, fifteen. Hey, we're gonna have four hundred bucks left over. <laughs> upgrade, please. Construct. Don't want to move this. No, we're gonna upgrade the coop. Yes. <laughs> Yay, hey, Cheryl. How's it going? We are upgrading this coop so we can get that dino egg going. Also, it's the joy of, like, apart from using the tabs from the wiki, the one thing I use the most of is the calculator when I'm playing Stardew Valley. I'm like, how much monies do I need to monies? <laughs> that much. All right, we have 400 left over. Ooh, look, you can buy some stuff. We can buy some stuff. I still want a workbench, but I'm broke now. <laughs> um... Should we do some floors? Ooh, those look so... It's different and cute and pretty. Let's do a wood floor. I have no wood, but whatever. And let's grab a... Oh, the brick floor looks cute. It's not like... Other stuff. We'll do stone and rustic plank floor. Now I've spent all my money. <laughs> and now if I pass out, it's fine. I just need to... I just need to level up. Um, did I... I think I did level up today, actually. We leveled up in farming, so if I really want to, I can stay out as long and as late as I want, and I'll only lose, like, eight bucks, and we can strategically pass out. I just want, to, I just want you to love me. Jeez, Linus. Delivery, 75. I don't have a cave care on me. Okay. Do I have a favorite gift list? Yes, I do. So it's on my website, and I think I have that listed in the description also. Yeah, thanks. Oh, Bacon, you're the best. Bacon added that list for you. So if you check out my website, it has um, a bunch of different references and resources that I like to use. Um, there's a bunch more stuff that I want to make, but at each one of those, like depending on which one it is, the loved gifts one took me approximately like three to four hours over a couple of days to make so um it is a little bit of a time commitment but i still think it's worth it now i use it all the time all the time Ooh, chests anywhere is so great yes but i have this restricted so i don't have to like go all over the place i wouldn't be able to open up my my chests from Ooh, hello Got some more salmon berries to survive. <laughs> that party emote kills me. <laughs> All right, so we have upgraded our axe. We have upgraded our pickaxe. And how much hay do we have? We have zero hay. I need to collect some hay so these chicky chickies can like do their chicky chicky thing. Hey, chicky chicky. Socials. I think it's, yeah, socials with an S. With an S. I'll link my Twitter and my... No, don't eat that. Instagram. Been playing DDV all day. Oh, nice. That sounds chill. 
Now we need like a lot of wood for stuff. We need a lot of stuff for stuff. It's seven o'clock on a Thursday. Luck is like mediocre. Okay, did I water all the plants today? Please tell me I did. I did, okay, good. I don't know why, I was stressing thinking that I did it. Let's go to forage and drop these mushrooms off. Drop that off, cool. <laughs> Spelling is hard. Good job. Good job, Clint. Uh, my um, in-game ones? My in-game work hours? Is that what you're talking about? Let's see here. I usually do my watering and everything first, if I can. Unless there's something that I need to take care of first, then I go take care of that first. We did water everything. Yeah, and then I planted those and it was <laughs> ridiculous. I didn't water Sticky. Oops. Sorry, Sticky. Sticky the cat. Ooh, you know what we should do? Like, we have a cat named Sticky. We should name our horse Stinky. Sticky and Stinky. Horses kind of have a smell to them, right? Um, I need to, so since we're going to be leveling up, I need to get us some, uh, pickaxe and stuff. Mindsy, no, resources, yes, drop that off. We need to get, um, copper, enough stuff to start making some sprinklers. Like, I have the ability to make the sprinklers, but I don't have the stuff to make the sprinklers. With my single salmonberry, oh my gosh. Let's find something to eat. Should we eat some leeks? We have got 20 horseradish, horse, horseradish words. Oh, I'll bring that with me. I will eat some cave carrots and then I'm going to eat one of those and we'll eat a leek too. I'm not going to end up selling the gold star quality ones or the silver. They're just going to be seeds eventually at some point. I'm just going to eat a couple of these. My real life work hours? Oh my gosh, I don't even know. <laughs> I play everything by ear because my work schedule, my life work schedule is pretty sporadic. I just have one Sundays off because they're closed unless it's like um, a wedding or an event or something. Um, and sometimes I'll help with those, but... Oh, during the daytime, if I wake up in the morning... <laughs> When I wake up in the morning, I have um, homeschool with the kids. <sighs> it's a lot. And then if they're doing stuff, then I can do some work in, on editing and stuff. Which is why things haven't been coming out as much. I've been working a little bit more than usual with springtime. Here you go. Yeah. Money. Then we do lunch and dinner and around dinner time is when I go to work. And I do like a four to six hour shift depending on the day. So they're not very long shifts. They're okay. But it's pretty late in the night. <laughs> You're sacrificing Stardew Valley time to <laughs> Oh, that's so sweet. That's such a compliment. Oh, we haven't gotten to gold levels yet. Oh my gosh, why? Why have I not? One, two, three, two, um, let's do a quartz. <laughs> like even if I wanted to make uh, some sprinklers now, I can't even. <laughs> Um, we're gonna have to find some ghosts, maybe. Ooh, a diamond! Hello, friend. Hello, scroll. Yeah. 70 hours, that's rough. I don't like that. <laughs> I would love to work a lot less. Someday. Come 
Uh, give me a ladder. I don't think we're gonna make any progress. So maybe we should just do, since it's like 10 o'clock, we'll just do like a little bit of pop up and down stuff. Um, the other minecart got there from editing the config file. After you launch Stardew Valley Expanded for the first time, there is a config file that'll pop up in the mod folder that you can enable stuff. And if you want more information about how to enable that, that's um, listed on the Stardew Valley Expanded fandom wiki page. They have like um, game settings and stuff, a game setting page there, which is pretty nice. <laughs> Chop them, chop them old trees. Come on, give me some ghosts and dust sprites, please. I like ghosts because I give you some um gold. Ghosts for gold, dust sprites for coal. Ooh, hello. One with a little star dongle. What you got? Super special slime. A magnet ring. Well, that's money, I guess. I'll sell it eventually. Not today. And then hit 50. Back in the house, you work 72 to 84 hours. Yeah, that's rough. Back in the day. Um, oh, yummy, mommy. Um, I used to be a bit more a bit more organized, but I'm not anymore. Uh, the whole, like, um... Quarantine stuff has like changed work hours drastically for me. <laughs> or back when it that happened. Like a lot of stuff is takeout nowadays, but it's hard to do takeout cocktails. <laughs> so I'm still needed. <laughs> Insight. <laughs> yeah, this they can give you the the star dongles can give you rings. They can also sometimes give you like shoes or boots or gear. I like them because uh, sometimes you can get like hammers and stuff from them, which is super great. We are not doing progress today. We're just like gathering resources today. If we happen to find some ore, that's great. If we happen to find some more coal, that's super great. Hi, David. Make sure not to spam the chat though. Do, 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 do. You make us sound old with the whole back in the day. <laughs> For me, back in the day was like, uh, oh, anything p before COVID happened is back in the day now. <laughs> it's been a long two and a half years, three years, however long it's been. It's been long. Have I left my house? Yeah, like once or twice. <laughs> you know. To go t cocktails are good, but also they're not legal everywhere. <laughs> not everywhere, anyways. I'm enjoying it so far, Kara. Thanks for asking. It's one o'clock. I should get going. Okay, let's go. Oh, no, wait. I can pass out. I'm allowed to pass out. That's the thing. I told myself it was okay today. So we're not going. We're going to pass out on purpose. I'm getting a lot of cave carrots. That's pretty great. Okay, ghosty. Give me your gold. Give me your soul. <laughs> Wait, I bet you the inside of ghosts are pretty sparkly if they have solar essence and gold inside, right? Sorry for destroying your sparkle and your shine, ghost, but I need it. Oh, sweet. We got some gold. I'm going to pop up. I don't think that's en enough. I don't think what I have is enough to make a bar. Oh, it's just enough to make one bar. Oh, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> I know, Jessica, it needs to end. I still wear my mask when I go out cause, because I got children. I don't want to get sick. Gross. Michigan only legalized to go alcohol because of COVID. Yeah, certain areas of Oregon too, did too. <laughs> yeah, learning how to mix cocktails at home is really, really great. 
My favorite cocktail is a bottle of vodka in the freezer. <laughs> that's it. No, it's not my favorite, but it's my favorite one to make. That's it. That's, that's, all, that's all that's in it. <laughs> okay, we're going to check it's Pierre's birthday today. That's nice. Breezy tomorrow. Bat's luck. And that's it. Pierre's birthday. Oh, he likes so Pierre actually likes a couple more things now with the Sturdy Valley expanded. Let's look at the sheet. Du -du -du -du. So stuff that I don't have, but he likes these are frog legs and this is some blue moon thing that's super expensive that I can't afford. I don't have the recipe for frog legs, so whatever. But at least he's not a special pretty pretty princess who loves only fried calamari. Okay. So there's options later. <laughs> uh, one bar and one bar only passes out. Yeah. <laughs> oh, MZ curls a lot. It is so you can pass out very strategically and it's really, really good to do. Like um, if you have less than 10 gold in your pockets, passing out will cost you nothing. So that's always a good thing to do. If you leveled up that day, Passing out will give you full energy the next day. So using it strategically, it sometimes it's worth it more just to spend the extra like hour or two in the mines to gather more stuff. Um, because then it, if you pass out, it, there's no like issues in the morning. It's easier to do early in the game than it is later in the game. Cause later in the game, you're not really getting a whole bunch of um, level ups. Cause you're usually like pretty great already. Uh, I'll keep these on me. I gotta bring these back to the, the mines. We got some donations. I could do some donations. Hey, Renee, how's it going? Yeah, Trish, it will go up on my website soon. Right now, it's just on Reddit. Um, on the expanded, uh, subreddit. You tend to hoard your... Yeah, so if sometimes when I play, depending on what I'm doing in an earlier playthrough you get a lot of things like um, quests and stuff done I won't collect the money until I need to use it because of that reason because if I'm gonna pass out I don't want to lose money at all I don't want to lose 10% of the 500 gold that I have or whatever I'll just save it for later speaking of money I have none <laughs> you learned it from what yeah it can be very very helpful Speaking of stuff, I forgot to feed my, I don't know what, what made me think of that. I forgot to feed my chickens yesterday because I'm a terrible chicken mom. <laughs> the worst. Uh, you have people, yeah. <laughs> Amanda, that's happened. It happens in different areas too. Oh, welcome in Mary. Nice to see you. Thank you. It's 1 a.m. here. <laughs> Sorry, Renee. I was thinking of doing an earlier stream, but with my late night, um, I work late night bartending, so um, this is about as early as I can do right now until I cut back on my hours. When did I go to bed last night? 4 a.m. I think it was 4 a.m. Or it was like, it was like 3, 3.45, whatever. Something like that. All right, we got some grass cut, and we're gonna let these chickens out. They're gonna do their chickeny things. We're going to say hi to Robin. Hey, buddy. I know, I know. And then grab two. I'm only gonna do two, because later I'm gonna build a chest and pull all the hay out, and then we're going to, um, there you go. There you go. <laughs> Sorry, chickens. Later we're gonna do some stuff. Um, should we see? We should see what Mabel has for us today because like that would be great. I could come up with some money if she has anything good. Maybe. Oh, what's in the mail? 15 gold. That's how much it cost me to pass out because we had 150. So it was 10%. That, which, you know, that's worth it to me. It's totally fine. Mm-hmm. <laughs> get banned from another from Stardew Valley because I'm a bad chicken. I know it should it shouldn't be the case. My name is literally has chickity in it. I should be a good chicken mom but apparently not.
Mm. Nani, everything that I do, anytime I, I, I play um, Stardew Valley, it's with getting perfection in mind. I tend to try to do that with any playthrough. Like, it, it takes forever, but I'm a, a person that likes having goals and something to work towards. So having that um, perfection tracker added in with the 1.5 update, that was like so helpful for me because then... Um, I accomplished the, you, it used to be where I would just accomplish the community center and then stop playing because I finished whatever goal was set ahead of me, right? So with the, um, stay over there, chicken. <laughs> Don't come over here. <laughs> Anyways, uh, with the perfection tracker, that helps me a lot. It gives me something to be more goal orientated, which I love. Um, you're up all night, says you work third shift. Yeah. You were at- I was wondering why you were in here, because you're usually in here later, Clint. Or maybe. Yeah, Mabel, Mabel is the name I named for her, because it makes me think of, um, of Mabel from Gravity Falls, which is like one of my favorite shows. I've only watched it on like five times. <laughs> boop, 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 boop. Oh, hey, welcome back, Rick. You somehow got a giant cauliflower. What does that mean? It means money. So giant cauliflowers, you can break them with your ax um, and it can give you, I think it's up to 20. I usually prefer to hold on, wait until breaking it until it's a good luck day because if you have a good luck day, you'll actually get more cauliflower from it. Or if you really like and you want to keep it for decoration, it's never going to rot and it's never going to like die. So you can just keep it on the farm forever. It is like put a little fence around it, look at it and think it's all pretty and stuff. It's great. I like it. Bloop. You're very new and you love Gravity Falls. Oh yeah, Gravity Falls is so great. <laughs> Adventure Time is good too. And what else do I like to watch? I like Steven Universe a lot. I haven't watched that again in a while. I should probably watch it again. Ooh, we watched Infinity Trains. Um. There's a lot of good shows out there. Kipo, which I have a uh, a cat, a gray cat, and his name is Yum Yun after the cat in Kipo. Or Kipo and the Wonder Beast, I think it's called. I love those kind of shows, though. They're interesting, magical. Hey, guess that I don't have to water those. Because <laughs> they're just there. They're mistakes, but they're happy mistakes. Like like a, a Bob Ross little tree, right? Just paint a little a little tree over your happy little mistakes. I love Bob Ross. <laughs> um, giant crops cannot grow in the greenhouse and they cannot grow on Ginger Island. Not without like mods. They can only grow outside. That would be cool though. Boo 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 boo. Alright, we should probably do some donations. It's Friday. I'm going to go check some stuff. We're going to donate that. We're going to donate that. Um, This fire course I'm going to hold on to until I can finish the, the bundle. <laughs> we can finish the adventurer's bundle. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So there's that. Let's um go to resources. Drop this off. Drop that. Drop that off. And this random torch that's in my pocket. Why are you in my pocket? I don't know. But it's there. <laughs> oh, good night, Renee. Have a good night. Sleep well. You used to watch him painting on TV? Yeah. When I go, um, whenever I fly, sometimes they have, like, Bob Ross on. That is so good. It just, like, chills me out. I hate flying, so <laughs> it chills me out, and it's really great. So we've got four things to donate. Maybe we'll get some good seeds. Ooh, I almost forgot. We have a little bit more fiber. Soon I need to go on like a super tree chopping day. But I don't know if today is that day. Because I still want to get stuff for sprinklers, right? And I don't have the stuff for sprinklers. Um, 
I can make a gold bar today and then we'll be able to get the mine carts completely finished. I think, yes. I should be able to get the mines completely finished. Actually, let's focus on getting that done today. Boom, boom. So there's for the mine carts and then a bar and a bar for the mine carts. All we need is a gold bar and that's it. Oh. Yay. <laughs> Sorry, I got excited. <laughs> You sleep to Bob Ross? Nice. I've gotten my uh, children to watch Bob Ross too. Um, I stream for about three hours, Rick, so I got another hour and a half. Currently. Currently, that's what we're working on. Um, Should we try and talk to Andy? Because he seemed really upset the other day, and I kind of want to be friends with the cranky cranker. Cranky crank pants. Cranks. Mr. Cranks a lot. That's his name. And then I have only a few cave carrots to eat. We'll just eat cave carrots. That's totally fine. Cave carrot life. Yeah, we've got so many trees. If I just want the trees or the wood, all I have to do is just like do stuff. <laughs> uh, yummy yummy. I love the remix bundles. I think they're so fun. They add a, a nice little like layer to the game especially with people like me who've played so many times um a oh, duck feather <laughs> i usually like to buy the duck feathers i have them because it takes forever but we're upgrading our coop so it should be fine oh wow 400 gold for a, a slime 500 gold for a tortilla that's gotta be a very special tortilla but it's like whole grain and vegan tortilla. Wait, aren't tortillas normally vegan? No, not if you do it with lard. <laughs> Look at her little sass face. I love her little pig pin though. So this, I name her Mabel and I name him Waddles after Gravity Falls because what made me originally think of it is because Waddles has, or this pig has a little fez and glasses just like Grunkle Stan in um in Gravity Falls, and so I'm like, oh, it's Grunkle Stan as a pig. No, it's Waddles as Grunkle Stan. That's who it is, right? Did we want to talk to Andy? Yeah, I wanna try and talk to Andy real quick. And then we'll go to visit, um... Hi, Andy. We'll go to visit people and stuff and things and maybe see some spring onions? Spring onions? No spring onions, dang. Yeah, pineapple, exactly. Hey, Andalandy, Andalandy. Finally, Friday. Now I can have a drink without feeling guilty. <laughs> you have to wait for Friday for that? Isn't it every day? Okay, bye. <laughs> I wonder if there's a cutscene from going inside his house or something. Nope. Okay, cool. Yeah, there's um a few different people and there's some people that you have in the vanilla game that you can actually marry. Yeah, Mikey answered, but with this you can actually marry the wizard, which is cool. And um This is Sophia, she's one of the new bachelorettes. I wanted to look pretty today, so I put on some eyeliner. Yeah, it looks good. You look you look good. Aw, thanks. Oh, yeah. Anytime, girl. Anytime. She's nice, I think. I think. I don't know. Uh, what am I doing? It's. Do I have anything to give to. I think there's some flowers up by the community center. I'll grab one of those to give to Pierre. We gotta go pet the dog. Hey, Dusty, all the pets for you. Check the trash, check the trash. We'll grab a flower, give it to Pierre, and then drop all this stuff off. And then I gotta make a, um, a gold bar. He hasn't heard five o'clock somewhere. <laughs> In Stardew Valley, it's always five o'clock. Maybe. 
Uh, yes? <laughs> oh, to the fish shop. I thought it was like, didn't I sell it to you, Pierre? <laughs> it was pretty high quality. Yeah, you're so welcome. I'm great. Yeah, here, take this. That's for your birthday. I hope you like it. I mean, deal with it. No, I don't have anything I want to sell to him. I don't know if you get friendship hearts with Dusty. There should be like a little buff that you get from petting the dog. There, Dusty isn't on the the relationships, but I do it just for for uh, anyways. <laughs> okay, we'll do community center first. That way I can grab some stuff, and then I'll um, drop some stuff off with uh, Gunther. Gunther. <laughs> Gunther makes me think of from like Adventure Time. <laughs> Gunther the Penguin. Is it Gunther the Penguin? Yes. And then one, two, Frozen Tear, Fire Quartz. Now we got two rewards Omni Geodes and a Magnet Ring. And then all we need is a gold bar. Gold! Gun that's why I call him Gunther, because that's how like Ice King says it. <laughs> I love him. <laughs> He's the best penguin. The best penguin. Dun, 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 dun. Okay, well it's four o'clock. I've got two hours to go to visit Gunther. Hey Sebastian, what are you doing out of your room? Oh, okay. Sorry. I'm sorry. I was just saying hello. Oh, hey, Victor. What up, bunny? Yeah, it's, it's good. It's good. Hi, Pam. Okay. Yeah, a hobby. What would be a... Uh, what do you guys think a good hobby for Pam would be? No. Pam, you can't play checkers against yourself because you would always lose. I don't see you ever winning that. Oh, Dr. Demon, I have linked all of the mods in the description. So if you want to check these ones out, you can go there. They're all on the Stardew Valley Nexus. Uh, and drinking Is drinking a hobby? Yes. <laughs> I mean, no. Oh, Caroline, she just whipped out from back there. Um, let's donate to the museum. So I guess uh, Gunther comes out. I can't say it regular anymore. Gunther. Gunther comes out from behind the desk and he like wanders around and stuff now. Oh, I got the last scroll. I didn't even realize that. Sweet. <laughs> I just leave everything here. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye, 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 Caroline, bye. Thanks for the tea sapling recipe. Never talk to you again. <laughs> we gotta go. Uh, I'm gonna head back. I know it's a bad luck day, but. Oh, I'm not gonna make much progress today at all. Maybe we'll just do some fishing or something. Oh, sorry, Dr. Demon. Oh, hey, Jody. <laughs> I say that to people a lot. Usually I say it in my head because I don't know if people would understand what by Felicia is, but I guess it's a more popular movie than I remember. <laughs> From Friday. It is Friday, so I could totally say bye Felicia to everybody today, right? Da -da -da -da. Da -da -da -da. I haven't watched that in a long time. Okay, so I did want to go to the mines purely because... I want to get this gold bar going, right? So that is important. And then we're going to go drop some stuff off. Forage, forage, forage. Boom. Yeah, we'll drop that off. Oh, I don't need these seeds. Seeds. And then let's go back to Minesy. Is there anything I can sell? I wish you could sell the slingshot, but you can't. Um, I think that's good. Yeah, and then we'll bring some quartz in case we need to smelt those. It's too late to open my geodes today, but I can absolutely do that next time. I'm going to go through the backwoods. Hey, kitty kitty. 
Pam's hobby is yelling at Vincent and Chaz. Get off her. Does she have a lawn? Her lawn is like one blade of grass in the middle of a dirt field. <laughs> Get off of my one blade of grass lawn. <laughs> I worked really hard on that one, one weed right there. That's Pam's garden. Uh, there's Linus. Hey, buddy. Oh, bye, buddy. I guess. See you later. I'm gonna sell a couple of things to the Adventurer's Guild. Yeah. <gasps> Ooh, let's give Linus this, um, Silver Star Mushroom. That's for you. Let's be friends. Please love me. <laughs> It'd be more than one blade of bits to kick it off of it. I know, right? Uh... It seems rude. I feel like Jazz is the type of person, though. She would make eye contact with Pam the whole time while she's picking the grass and be like, what? What are you going to do about it? What? Like that. Absolutely. She's a monster. <laughs> okay, so we have uh, three. Cool. We're going to do that and that and a... That's going to be ready in five hours. Five hours after seven o'clock is a time that I don't know. I'm gonna sell all this stuff. They're not worth a whole bunch, but they're worth enough for me to like do stuff with it. Cool. Cool, 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 cool. Plus I wanna go visit my guys. Ooh, I forgot I have a glow ring too. It's been there for so long that Pam is basically worshiping that grass now. <laughs> uh, yeah. What if it's like one wheat seed? And she's like, this wheat is going to turn into something someday. And if I just leave it, maybe it'll grow me a beer. I don't know. Okay. Magnet ring, magnet ring, big magnet ring, little glow ring, rusty sword, and some leather boots. Thanks for the money, honey. Thanks for the money, honey. Let's look at our board. Um, Cave insects. We could still do that. Uh, halfway there. Oh, uh, yeah, we're more than halfway there. That would be one, that would be like 63, 62 is halfway. We're halfway there. Oh, uh, I'm singing on stream again. Just ignore me. <laughs> uh, no, it's bad. It's bad for my health. Don't do that. We're going to drop this off and go like so. Save the leek to eat. Save the mushroom to eat. I got a couple of mushrooms at home, but we'll eat that first. And then, down. Oh, hey, Flash Shifter, welcome back in. Yeah, I've been loving it so far. I love it so much, I made this here for people. <laughs> uh, a little updated, like, um, love gift. So I have this for the vanilla version of the game, but I have such a hard time keeping track of everything. So this has all the love gifts with all of the people and their birthdays on it. It's been super helpful. But I loving the game so far. <laughs> Sorry, I get all I get all weird when people are watching me <laughs> and as I'm streaming. <laughs> I haven't updated. I saw that you uh, updated it today or yesterday on Twitter, but I haven't updated it yet. So I gotta get around to that. <laughs> I'm being weird. Uh, I hope your Sunday's doing great, Flash. Though, welcome in. Crazy. When you do mining, it doesn't really matter what luck of the day is. You have the same, yeah, that's true. I mean, as long as you, if you go after the monsters, it doesn't matter how much or what your luck is too, because the the chances of uh, getting staircases and stuff from the monsters doesn't change, which is nice. I think we're after like ghosts and stuff again, right? With gold and, oh, there's one. Gold from the ghosts, cause I needs the gold. And I have not leveled much yet. Uh, yeah, Flash Shifter is the, the mod creator, guys. Make sure to give him a follow on Twitter, too. He keeps uh, everybody up to date when there's new things. And I'm still waiting on Clint to marry. No, not really. I've got my own Clint here. We've got Navy Wolf in the chat. It's the best Clint. Oh, so it wouldn't be missing out too much? Okay, cool, cool, good. Oh, you know, this isn't too bad with some bad luck, right? Look at all these dusties. Look at all the, there's a ladder right away. I might be able to make it to level 60. 
At 10 o'clock? Maybe. I don't know. Come on. Go, ghost. Go. <laughs> oh, thanks, Rick. Now we try and keep it comfy here. Oh, today is what? Sunday? I was thinking we're going to play on Sundays. I play board games at nighttime with the kids. I'm trying to decide which one to play. Like, I have the Stardew Valley board game, which is super, super fun. But oh my gosh, is that a long game, you guys. <laughs> Such a long game. Uh, you have to, like, dedicate, like, this is what I'm doing today. <laughs> We're playing this. And that's it. Ghosts are more irritated. Yeah, I think any of the the uh, monsters that have like a huge knockback can be really frustrating. So how I like to deal with ghosts when I'm playing is um, if I'm trying to walk a specific, same with bats, if I'm trying to walk a specific direction, then I kind of um, kite them around. I get them to follow me into the opposite of that direction so I can just walk into them like this. Does that make sense? That way, if I just like walk into the path, I'm not like losing too much time. I'm not knocking them out of bounds. And so I'm still making use of my time. But here I'm like not really on a path or anything. Oh yay, level up, sweet, we can pass out. <laughs> I'll only lose 50 bucks. Yeah, there's a board game, guys. It is amazing. It is, it's very fun, but it's very involved. Um. I own it uh, once it was announced on the first the first time it was announced on Concerned Apes Twitter. I, I picked it up and uh, I think there's been a couple re-releases since then. My sister owns the game. I don't think she's played it yet, but um, she owns it. I was thinking of like doing a how to play it thing, but I feel like that's been done a lot. Ooh, coal. <laughs> yeah, once you know how, what you're doing, it's okay. That's good. Let me go search the board game on, on me Google. Yeah, do it. But it's, um, yeah, it's definitely, <laughs> it's not really hard. Um, there's a lot of pieces and parts to it too. I made a, a organizer for myself out of like, um, what's that stuff called? This, the foam stuff people use for making cosplay things. Ooh. Whatever, I don't know. Words. <laughs> you found it, nice. Yeah, but I love board games. Board games are like so great. We're not going to make it. It's it's too late. EVA foam. Yeah, that's the stuff. I had a bunch of extra sheets of those, but like the cheap kind, so they weren't as good. Um, So I I cut it all up. It, I posted it on my Reddit, so you can always look in my Reddit and find it there. But I made like a little organizer. It's not as good as stuff that you can get from Etsy though. Like Etsy, they make some good ones. They're like a hundred bucks for an organizer though. I think it might be good just to keep all the bits and pieces into bags, honestly. Two, three, four. One, two, three. Boop, boop, boop. Yeah, gold bar's ready. That's ready. So this gold bar is going to be for the mine carts, which I don't have time to get to the community center right now. Otherwise, I absolutely would rush there. Let's bring these with us so we can go crack those open. Maybe tomorrow. Yeah, that would be fun. And then um, drop this gold off here. Anything else we need to leave here? I've got a little bit of time, so I'm just going to go to 55, see if there's like any dusties or... There's a dusty. Give me some coal. <laughs> and a pass out. Yay, pass out. Foam core. Hi, Bulls. How's it going? Um, Level four combat. Cool, cool, cool. Level up is great. Because now I'm bright-eyed, bushy-tailed, full of energy. It's Emily's birthday. We're going to give her this topaz, probably. She loves the topazes. Topazes. We've got Breezy, 
We've got bats for our fortune and a second to last day of spring. Cool. Miss Wickety Woo, last night a Joja member found you. I know. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Uh, wait, your your real life garden or your Sardu garden? <laughs> Yay, pass out! I was actually um, I'm gonna be making a, a passed out wickety emote too. I already have the the um, drawing set up in my sketchbook somewhere, so that'll be coming out soon. <laughs> so every time I pass out, you guys can just drop it in the chat. I mean, it works. Oh, one of the nice things is, is that even though I don't have my sprinklers, we're going to get sprinklers because that's that's going to be my focus for today and tomorrow is getting the resources for sprinklers. And then um, because we can finish the minecarts and that'll be done overnight and then we'll have everything set up for summer. And then I got to come up with a little bit of money, probably sell a few things. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. We got this. We got this. <laughs> Let's go to forage. No, resources. Real life, you got several flowers started. Yes, that's great. My garden is like um this old pot outside the front door that I have had for like 12 years. I stole it from my mom. Well, I didn't steal it, she gave it to me, I think. I think. <laughs> It's mine now, so that's all that matters, okay? Oh! Oh my gosh! Guys, the coop is done! You know what that means? Ah! Okay, where is it? Where is it? Gimme, give gimme! Give we have a... This dinosaur egg, so excited! Okay, um, also I'm gonna grab this, uh, wood. We're gonna put seven back. Craft a quick little chest. I'm fine. <laughs> oh, Rick, I like uh, Wickedy Chickity, but um, when I was like in, when I was streaming on Twitch and I would like join people, people couldn't say the, the full name for some reason. And it was, I don't know. I like Wickedy. Wickedy was the original thing that I wanted, but um, me being all about having consistency in my branding and everything, I wasn't able to open up a wickety Twitch and I wasn't able to open a just wickety Instagram because those were both taken by other things. So I went with wickety chickety and then it's wickety for short. Because that's my name. Well, it's not my real name, but <laughs> it is It is really my name. <laughs> I like it. I like them both. It's like, you know, you go by your first name or you go by your nickname or, or something like that. Are my chickens out doing chicken things? Yes, they are. Okay. We're going to pull all of the hay out. Cool. And then we're going to put um, probably this one right here. Put the hay in here. There's a couple of things I have to water my uh, coffee plants because those are still going to be good. So we only have to water a few things. We're going to have a lot of energy. All right. It's time to put the dino egg into here. Yeah. It's going to be ready in, oh, 11 days. That's a long time. It'll be ready eventually, though. We're going to hug these chickens and love them. Perfect. Oh, goodness. Sorry. That was a hiccup. Um, I do have to water this patch of strawberries, though, because this patch of strawberries has the speed grow on it, and they will give me strawberries on the very last day. Should. Oh, no, these ones will. This is the patch. I watered the wrong patch. The nice thing about the UI info suite is it'll tell me which ones um, will be worth it and not to water. And then these will be ready in one day, which will be tomorrow. I need more water. When, um, so I think it was like day three or day four or day two, like somewhere in the very first week, I went fishing and I found it in a box. I think, right? Who knows? I knows, you guys knows, it's somewhere. Yes, I found it in a box while fishing, which was pretty, pretty good. I was very excited. And I'm excited that we're actually gonna be able to have some like dinos now. 
Ooh, our forage is actually almost up again. That's cool. <laughs> you often uh, respond to, hey, you, <laughs> and what's your name again? <laughs> Uh, yeah. My my name is Ava, for those of you who don't know. That's my name. Ava Wickety of the Chickadee Clan Farmness. Or just Mom. <laughs> that's the name I go by mostly, because that's what I hear my kids call me all the time. Cool. Let's get some sprinklerage going. Those are done. What about the green beans? The green beans, we don't need those. And those are good. Okay, cool. And all the cauliflower. I could have just left them. No. You can't get a giant cauliflower unless the, they get watered. So never mind. We'll water the cat. Sticky the cat. Boop. Memory of a goldfish. Oh my gosh. Yeah. <laughs> I, uh, we call it mom brain here. I've got mom brain, seriously. Okay, we are going to go to crops and seeds. Look at all these cauliflowers. Look at all these things. We need to make some more um, stuff. It's nice. It's nine o'clock and uh, everything's done. How much? Let's go to forage. No, that's not forage. Where's my wood axe? If you hold the tool, it'll show the experience bar. We have 152 experience left till up or till we uh, level up in foraging. That's nice. Let's go to the minesy section, drop those off and that. I want to crack all these geodes for fun. We're going to bring this gold bar over to the uh, community center. So that'll be done. And then Emily is going to have this topaz, or should I give her an amethyst? Amethyst is worth more, but I have more amethyst than topaz, so let's do amethyst. Oh, thanks! Ava is short for Avery, which is my name. <laughs> also, I have all the names, a list of many that I go by, and that is some of them. <laughs> but hey, you is one also. Uh, the cat is, is sticky because it got in the sap. I don't know. Maybe it got into the, um, this is on the sappy farm. Maybe the cat's on the sappy farm and that's why it got sticky or something. We should do these geodes for sure. Go drop this off. Drop that off. Um, I don't need to buy any seeds, but I do need to make some money. So if we want to do um, resource stuff for money, I'm going to have to chop some wood. I'm going to have to gather some fiber. Um, it's tough. So I either need to focus on getting stuff for sprinklers, which is going to be seriously important, or I need to focus on stuff for money, which is also going to be seriously important. But I have crops that I can sell, so I think I'm okay with the money stuff. I can just sell some of these extra things and then we'll be good got some strawberries. We've got one more round of strawberries. Ooh, I missed a... I can see by looking here that I missed a strawberry. See this? Yeah, there it is. We want every strawberry. Every strawberry. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna drop that off. Chop them all trees. <laughs> we have the memory of a guppy on a hallucinogenic substance. <laughs> That's like a non-memory. <laughs> There's no memory involved in that. It's just colors and shapes and things. Hi, Cody. How's it going? Welcome in. <gasps> Ooh, a leak. I do love the leaks. Even wickety of the chickadee farm thing or plain old boring mom. <laughs> yes. Uh, that's a meow. <laughs> Well, my name is more like Mom. <laughs> Sorry, I had to yell off. But uh, it, I only um, answer to Mom at like ten decibels. <laughs> uh, what am I in here? I'm not in here for anything. We need Emily. Oh, but while we're do at it, let's go check the trashes. You think a car just crashed? What? Oh, George, shut up. I mean, sorry. George, I'm sorry. 
Here. Evelyn, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. <laughs> Emerald. Uh, no, single forever. I'm married to myself. Technically. Not technically. Like emotionally. I'm in a long-term relationship with myself, but I can see other people, you know, depending on the day. <laughs> um, Emily's at home, I think, but she doesn't come out for a little bit. So we're going to drop this gold bar off first. Yeah. Yeah, gold bar first. And then we'll get this done. Heck yeah. Let's get it. Let's get it. Let's get it. Um, little Junimo. I wonder if their colors are always random or if they have different colors in the different rooms for different reasons. Anyways, blacksmith bundle is done. So that's baller. And a furnace. Sweet. You have the slime tremor ring and got scared to get close to the big slimes. I forget that I have the napalm ring on half the time. It's horrible. Not in this playthrough, obviously, but <laughs> it's so bad. And I'm the type of person who likes to have monsters spawn on the farm because I like extra resources early on. Uh, we are the Junimos, keepers of the forest. Um, oh, Rick, uh, sometimes I play Pokemon, Fallout, Skyrim. Um... Various different games depending on my mood. I play Graveyard Keeper a lot when it came out. I'm excited these minecarts are done. I don't know, just whatever suits my fancy. My kids have been trying to get me to play Minecraft, but I've mentioned this before that once I start playing Minecraft, I won't stop playing Minecraft. So that's why I have not I have not started it. Oh. Break it up, guys. Go. I got trashes to check. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. Do that. Okay, they're far enough away now. <laughs> you speak Junimo? Is uh, Junimo-ish or Gino, Juno, Junimoodle? I don't know. Hey, Emily. I uh, stopped my peers and bought a parsnip. It was the first time I've seen one of those there in a while. It's springtime. Filled the house with a different or oh, odor. Uh, he found it in the trash. It wasn't mine, I swear. <laughs> Take this. Love me. <laughs> Three hearts. Okay, cool. All right, Lily, have a good nap. That's how you feel about Minecraft? Yeah. Hyper, that's the problem that I have. Uh, it's like, what, that's probably why I stick to one game for a really long time. Because I get super hyper-focused. <laughs> super hyper-focused on something. Uh. Oh, thank you so much, Emerald. I'm happy to cheer you up. I really like that, like I started this channel just to like give myself a creative outlet, but I'm really happy that people enjoy it and that people like get something out of it. Cause at least I'm not just doing it just for me, right? <laughs> for Rossus, these GS, let go with, let's go with regular first. And I think I have enough money for everything. Yeah, we got enough money for everything. Um, let's see. You were doing some major farm. I, I can read that. Major farm layouts and updates on coops. You often have an empty chest and no space to pick up the now floating. Oh, that's weird. Um, sometimes, yeah. So sometimes, um, the game gets a little weird. Like if there's something tossed and floating somewhere, when you sleep overnight, it'll, it'll get deleted. If it's on your farm, I think that it happens more often than if it's off of your farm. So, yeah, I think it's gone. Um, if you exit out of your game, it's definitely gone. But sometimes if you're outside of the farm and you drop something when your pockets are full or whatever, I do this a lot with fishing and I don't have a chest nearby, um, it doesn't disappear. But it's really risky. It's really risky to do it either way. So, unfortunately, it usually just disappears. Sorry. That happened to me the other... Day. No, yesterday I was playing on my Switch and I forgot. <laughs> I forgot the rules. I was, like, um, playing on a, the hilltop farm. And I, I pickaxed all of the copper that were up there and I forgot, ooh, yay, more gold. I forgot that I was um 
on the farm and I left all the copper out because my pockets were full and then I woke up the next day and it was all gone. I was really sad. I was like 30 copper <laughs> on like the third day. Uh, let's sell a couple of, let's sell the opal. We don't need that. And sell the sandstone. But this we can donate. And we'll keep one earth crystal. So Clint likes earth crystals. He doesn't love them, but he likes them. We could totally give him an earth crystal. Here, buddy. That's for you. Um, I'll be streaming for another, about an hour. Or 45 minutes. Yeah, I usually try and keep it to three hours because that's as long as my bladder can handle. <laughs> TMI, maybe. <laughs> I don't care. Whatever. You know what you signed up for when you came here, guys. <laughs> it's me. <laughs> try to stay away from Minecraft. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I, I don't mind watching people. That's the thing is like, I love watching other people play games because then I don't always need to. There's some games that are really fun to watch other people play. What are we gonna do? We were gonna go see if we can do just a little bit more mining today, maybe get some gold. Where is the Jojo Mart trash can? Is it not here? I don't think Jojo Mart has a trash can anymore, do they? Sad. <gasps> Oh, that's why the trash can was moved. So the trash can that used to be by Joja, that's why they moved it over to Olivia's house. So that there's still a trash... Is this too close to Abigail? I don't know. Twenty-five thousand gold gone. Oh, sorry. That's horrible. <laughs> that's horrible. Yeah, be careful leaving stuff out, you guys. Because... Honestly, I think what happens if it's not bolted to the ground, when Lewis comes to your place to go take all your stuff from shipping, he claims it. He's like, oh, well, this is just, you know, this isn't laying around, this is just laying around, it's mine now. That's, that's what I decided happens to everything. Lewis has it somewhere. Mm -hmm. We can make one gold bar. And then we'll make a couple of these because I'm almost out. Three, four. It would be nice if they all went, like things that were left out went into the, um, the little box, the lost and found place in Lewis's house. That would be swell, but I doubt it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Imagine, like, Lewis just needs, like, a twirly mustache, right? He really does. Like, the villain mustache with the twirls, or, like, the super hipster mustache, and he just, he twirls it. Man, now. <laughs> just the finger wiggles. <laughs> uh, I can see that. Let's go to 55. Oh, yeah, he'd definitely take all of it. <laughs> Uh, Lewis. Especially if it's gold. Absolutely. Oh, and really? That's weird. Sometimes the game does weird things. I'm not sure we're going to be having much um, luck with ladders from rocks, so I might just hit this level a few times to see if we can get a level with quite a few monsters in it. If we get quite a few monsters here, it'll be a little bit easier to, um, um, ba -ba 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 -ba, slay them all and maybe get a ladder. Only one. <laughs> Oops. Just one. Oh, there's some more. Hey, Dusty Boys. Dusty Dusty. Do, do. Give me an escape plan. Please. Nope. Well, I guess I'll just, like, break some rocks anyways. 50 to 55. Would that work? I don't have to go all the way up to the top. Da, 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 da. 
fifty. Fifty-five. Hmm. I usually like to... I just hit the top to refresh it because it makes it easy. And again, there's nobody here. Gosh, what is... It's supposed... I wish that bad luck days, honestly. It has no effect on the amount of monsters that you get, but I really wish it did. I used to think that you got more monsters on bad luck days. It's just... It doesn't. And then I did some, like, looking into it, and it's just... It doesn't. It feels like it sometimes, though. Can you just, like, give me what I want? Please. Gold works for me. The dwarf has what? <laughs> Get more resources and sell. Oh. Yeah, monsters and the uh, bummer thing about monsters on your farm is they don't count. Oh, ladder. <laughs> they don't count towards your monster eradication goals or experience points. At least I don't believe so. I was playing it on I was like testing something out. Ooh, cool. Ladder sweet. I was testing something out like um, a farm. I was trying to see if I could get all my combat um, leveled up on the farm and it wasn't giving me any experience points from the bats and slimes there, which was so weird. Oh, you think the dwarf is the one who steals things off of you? I can see that. He does talk about that, doesn't he? Um, I want to slay this ghost, but I also kind of want to level. I just kind of want to level. We've got an aquamarine here. Aquamarine, ring, ring. What? Uh, can you? One of you, please give me like um an escape. That would be super great, please. Like I'm asking really nicely as I slay you and send you on your merry way into dusty heaven. I wonder what where they go after they get turned do, if they get turned into dust do like little dust particles get all on my arms and I'm really keeping their ashes with me forever if that's the case I'm okay slaying them because at least I'm a little dusty now I love the dust sprites you like to get the monster mask for bad luck days yeah that's that's smart let's eat some food I just want a dust sprite to follow me around everywhere, okay? Like, I'd be down with that. <gasps> or even if dust sprites showed up on your farm when you enable monsters, like they don't. You just get slimes and you get uh, bats and you get like the wilderness golems and then you get those shadow creepy guys and you get serpents and iridium bats depending on what level of combat you are. Um, but you don't get dust sprites. I would love that. Can you imagine like walking around at nighttime and having dust sprite time? It will be so great. You probably wouldn't be able to see it because it's dark. <laughs> they respawn as dust bunnies in people's homes. Oh, yeah, I can see that. I always feel like if it's a bad luck day, the ladder is further away from the entrance. So, that's why I search there. On good luck days, it's usually closer. Am I gonna make it to level 60? Debatable. Da -da, da -da, da -da. There, yeah! Our monster farm is kind of a hassle. I kind of feel like it depends. I like it for the loot because, oh, I hate this level. <laughs> um, I like it for the loot because um, bats can like drop bombs and bat wings. And I feel like I always need bat wings. So that's one of the reasons why I like it. But it can be a pain if you're someone who likes to do a lot of stuff at night on your farm. Usually I'm out of the farm by nighttime anyways. And so I don't really uh, have a lot of stuff going on. 
at night. I'm usually in the mines or I'm fishing elsewhere and doing something. So it has pros and cons. The pros are like being able to get the loot and the cons are like annoyances, <laughs> dying or, or the first few days before you get your sword when you're just trying to slay slimes with a scythe, it's terrible. <laughs> I hate it. Ladder location is, yeah. Nearest entrance on the floor, mm hmm Oh, don't wear the napalm ring. I've done that so many times. That's the worst, is wearing the napalm ring after you've had like a really good luck day and you spent some time in Skull Cavern, right? And you got all these good things and then you go home and you're like, oh, there's a serpent. Let me just take care of it real quick. And then guess what? <laughs> there went all of your crystallariums and everything. <laughs> Napalm ring. It's a blessing and a curse. Oh, Luke, I'm sorry. And getting a, a rain totem is kind of a pain too. You can find them in the chests and the treasure rooms in Skull Cavern, but also, like, it can be hard to get that. I think you have to hit level 9? Is it level 9 in foraging for rain totems? I know level 9 gives you the cooking spit, but I think it's also the rain totems. And then you have to have truffle oil. Oh, sweet! Yes, we made it to level 60, guys! Woohoo! It's my little celebration. <laughs> what do we got in the box? It's a crystal dagger. Dagger, dagger, dagger. Oh, level 12 crystal dagger. Oh, isn't that a thing that happened with, um, with the... Stardew Valley expanded. There were changes to all of the, the weapons. Well, not all of the weapons. A lot of the weapons had some adjustments, like the vanilla weapons. And it looks like the crystal dagger's been affected by something. I don't know why it says level 12, but that crit chance. Holy cow, look at that. Oh, Dark Geo, thank you so much. Uh, monster on the farm doesn't count. Yeah, that's sad. <laughs> I know, I wish. It would be so great if you could level up. I wonder how I, I had thought of a, a video of how um, long would it take me to get to level 10 of combat if I only fought on the farm but then I didn't get any experience on the farm at all so <laughs> that just threw that one in the, in the trash can uh. I did not remix the my so with this playthrough I just decided to keep everything like pretty um pretty standard because I felt like like the world itself was going to be remixed enough with all the weird interesting things going on. Let's go ahead and craft more of these and I can officially make one single sprinkler <laughs> with my one gold bar. We're still going to pass out. It's fine. Uh we'll have it tomorrow. I don't need to actually water any of the things that I have, but that'll be good. Um, I'll drop that off. Yeah, that's there's no way. Let's look at the um, let's look at the regular wiki page, uh, for crystal dagger, crystal dagger. Always have to put the word Stardew behind it, otherwise, uh, DuckDuckGo and Google like they're like, what are you talking about? Do you mean this crystal dagger? So yeah, it's usually level four and its damage is four to 10 and usually has crit power. Oh, that is very different. Well, let's look at this. Okay. Yeah, so normally the damage is four to 10 and this has 10 to 25. The crit chance is normally 0.3. This has a plus 14 crit chance. Oh my gosh. Crit power is the same and the weight is the same, but the crit chance is added, which I think is a, a new little buff thingy. And then that. Cool. I think we're going to switch to the crystal dagger. I don't usually like to play with daggers all that much because then everybody gets like really close and they touch me and I don't like it. Like, no, go away. <laughs> but uh, yeah, it'll work. I'm going to grab everything that I need before we pass out. 
let's go like kill let's see let's see how this works on um a ghost or something Ooh, that was nice <gasps> look at all that iron do i have time for that yeah i got time for that All in. This is so great. Look at that. Like, I don't even feel bad about how close they're getting right now. I think I have just enough time to take care of those. We won't have a level up, but that's okay. We'll just, like, power through some food. It's totally fine. Nice. And a pass out. Kind of intentional. Not strategic. Just, I wanted the stuff. <gasps> Ooh, yay! Yeah. Da, da. Junimo's getting them minecarts. Okay. Combat's usually the last skill for you. Uh. Rick, the templates, which, what are you talking about? The little, like, little sheets that I have? <laughs> hey, Andrew. Nice to see you. <laughs> I think anyone who dares a monster farm deserves a military badge of courage. Yeah. <laughs> it's a it's hard, but once you start getting like fighting the big big slimes helps. I like to focus uh, the reason why my combat is usually goes up pretty high is because I love to focus on getting my monster eradication goals taken care of because there's a lot of rewards there that I love. And so I sometimes get my combat higher than mining before that point but it is often um one of the last skills to get to 10 that and foraging maybe depending on which playthrough i'm doing um rick they are on my website those are all they should all be listed there apart from the one that i made just for this uh playthrough and um, I haven't added that on there yet, but that description is, or that, that link is in the description of the video. Foraging is always the last for you. Yeah, well, the thing with foraging, unless you focus a lot on getting seeds and stuff, it, trees don't give you that much. It, there isn't a whole lot of things that give you high amounts of foraging experience. The highest thing that you can get are those giant logs. Um, and the stumps will give you only 25 experience points each. And in the secret woods, they repopulate, but you're only getting six stumps every day. So sometimes it's hard, unless you focus on like wild seeds and stuff, then it's harder to boost your foraging up because trees don't give you a lot unless you chop a ton of trees. It's only 13 experience points per tree, which I think was like, Oh, I did the math like 2,000 trees or something like that to get from level 9 to level 10. <laughs> it's horrible. <laughs> Queen of the Sass, we got Amulet. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, Link with a, out an S. I don't know. L I N K, no S. <laughs> Words are hard and spelling's hard. There you go. And now I officially only have two plants to water. And those are my happy little coffee beans. Happy, happy little coffee beans. Um, We're going to see what Mabel has. And then we're going to finish working on... Let's get one sprinkler built. <laughs> one sprinkler. Yay. I'll put you... Let's put you right there. Yeah. Oh, good. One of your first to ten... Yeah, now that I started doing stuff with... um. The, the seeds, I get lo level 10 foraging pretty easy nowadays. I think I'm gonna get level seven. Yes, level seven farming. We can stay out as late as we want, but today we need to sell some stuff. So bad. So let's see if we can find some um, stuff to grab some fiber. How much is a duck? Is a duck 1200 gold? I think that's how much ducks cost, right? It's Sunday. We learned a salad and 39 gold to pass out. Cool, 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 cool. Yeah, I try and keep the, the links in the description too. 
Hi, Evie. How's it going? Um, I think it's 1,200 gold for a duck. Ducks, man. Ducks, Stardew. 1,200 gold. Oh, man. I'm so smart. I can't believe I knew that. Well, I, I knew that I knew it, but I didn't know that I knew it, you know? You know what I mean, man? You know. Just ignore me. <laughs> uh, this is for the dye bundle. We have some strawberry jelly we can sell. I'm just going to toss these in a box because I like to save the scrolls for things. Okay, let's assess. Assess some stuff. I can make like next to no tea saplings. So that's not going to be like a huge money maker for me today, is it? Unless we go and chop some trees. Oh, man. I think we're going to end up selling um just a bunch of stuff that's lying around. Which menu? This menu? Right here? I don't know. Uh, maybe you have the older version of it. This is version 2.2.1. So I would just double check that. We're just going to chop just a few trees just so I have enough to make a little bit of money. Boop, 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 boop. And eat this. Sunday, Sunday, Sunday. Oh, I gotta go hug my chickens too. Can't be a bad chicken mom. <gasps> and leveled up in foraging, no. I mean, cool. <laughs> you just died a little. <laughs> Evie. <laughs> I'm the same way, like, I watch different people on streams and if they say my name, it's a little bit more often that people will like mention me in stream because uh, I have a channel and stuff. I guess people know who I am. I don't know. <laughs> but I still like, ah, it's me. <laughs> That's how I get. So I, I hear you. Bump, bump, and chop just a couple of these. All right, there's a little bit of wood. Now we just need a little bit of fiber. Boop, 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 boop. Oh, sorry, frog. I destroyed your home. <laughs> you haven't reached perfection in vanilla yet. It takes a while, so it's all good. Just do what makes you happy. If it makes you happy to play this, then play this. If it makes you happy to get perfection, do it. But if you don't want to, don't do that. Yeah, happiness is number one. Wait, why does my greenhouse look not different anymore? I don't know. All right, we've got 133 wood, which is pretty good, but not enough fiber to make some saplings for money. Um, I'll probably have to hit the mines. Well, well, we're gonna go to the mines anyways, but what I'm gonna do is probably hit level 25 quite a few times because that's my fiber, uh, fiber level for before we hit level 80. Let's go ahead and water the cat. Hey, Sticky. Sticky icky kitty. And then the two coffee plants. Boop and boop. There we go. <laughs> oh, thanks, Rick. Rick Stemmler. How was it? Um <laughs> I'll go like this. We'll go to the forage. I'll drop these off. And then we'll go to the resources, we'll drop those off, and then we'll go make one, two, three, four. We'll make as many tea saplings as we can so we can get a good burst of money first um, first thing in the, in the season. Oh, I don't have any. I sold all those forage seeds, huh? We'll just grab, 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 and grab. One, two, three, four. There. I think we can make 80. Yeah, 80 seeds for now. I can make some more. I just don't have that much horseradish, guys. So we're doing the 
those that haven't watched it, this is the tea sapling method for making money. Um, it's been around for a bit. Four. One, two, three, four. I guess. Uh, but I like to make a bunch of tea saplings because they sell for 500 gold a piece early on and then later I moved to like other stuff. There's other methods that you can make better money than this. This takes a lot of wood and a lot of fiber to make anything. So there's 60 saplings just by using 30 wood, 30 fiber and 60 spring seeds and that's going to sell for 3,000 gold. So if you were to make 10 of them that's 5,000 gold. If you're to make 20 of them that's 10,000 gold. So we're gonna have so much money. It's like it's how I survive and live. <laughs> <laughs> oh, coffee. Oh my gosh. Andrew, I don't have any pocket fish right now, but on me, but we will. Oh, <laughs> uh, guys, I call I call sashimi pocket fish cuz once you make <laughs> sashimi, it stays in your pocket for <laughs> like so long. Can you imagine how disgusting that sashimi is? Poor uh well, I don't mind giving the disgusting sashimi to Pierre when he asks for it, but poor Sebastian. <laughs> it's like, hi, here's some fish. I made it into a dish for you and it's been in there since like spring. I think it was a snail at one point. <laughs> All right, so there's 3,800 gold. Cool. <laughs> List of progression from tree sapling passive money to later game methods that are better. Um, I don't know. Cheryl, I made a whole a full video about like tea saplings and everything, but um there's like um the only thing is that fiber and wood, sometimes it can be hard to get that much money or get that much fiber and wood to like make a whole ton. Unless you get fiber seeds and then you need clay and things. Or unless you have a deconstructor later. Um I was doing something. What was it? Oh sorry. I got forgot. I forgot. Oh. You do the same with goat cheese. Gosh, can you imagine how bad that goat cheese smells? Hi, I made this goat cheese from spring year one. No, from summer year one. But it's now spring of the, the seventh year. It's just extra stinky. <laughs> but you like that, right? Leah likes it. Stinky Leah. What's it doing? I don't know. Uh, we we're going to try and see what Mabel has. Oh, right. I need money to buy, um, I need enough money to buy a duck. Okay, so how many of these do we need? Three. I don't, I don't want to have too much because I will likely pass out today, guys. <laughs> likely. <laughs> I'm going to pass out today. Let's be real. Um, we'll be passing out. I think 90% chance of passing out today. Because I've leveled up, so... Um, with that, uh, what was it? With us passing out, I don't want to have too much money in my pockets. Otherwise, we'll lose them out a lot when we pass out. So I'm going to sell some stuff. And then we're going to go like here. Take this. That's enough money for um, a duck. Yeah, that'll be good. Enough money for a duck. And go get a duck from Marnie. And then we'll check with Mabel too. Hopefully she doesn't have anything. Well, I mean, I always want something, but hopefully nothing expensive. Let me drink some water. You can use tea saplings and grow for the tea leaves. And that's really nice because then you never have to water it. It just takes up a little bit of space, but um, I like to use the tea leaves and turn them into tea or pickles. You can turn them into pickles, they sell for more. It just takes longer to make them. With making tea leaves, if you make tea leaves with them, you get more money that way, but then you kind of have to babysit the kegs because it takes three hours to make tea. So if you have the time to waste on making tea, do the tea leaves. But if you don't want to, just make them into pickles and you'll be good. <laughs> Oh my gosh, lavender. Put that on my shirt. <laughs> Let's be real. <laughs> passing out, it's a, it's a part of the Stardew life, right? Are you a real gamer if you don't pass out? <laughs> no. That should be like a badge of honor. Hi, I am Wickedy. I've passed out 752 times while playing Stardew Valley. What you got? <laughs> 
<laughs> Eat this crusty bread. I love the crusty bread. Oh, they are so good for fences. I love tea saplings for fences. All right, we're gonna get a duck, guys. Let's uh, let's name a duck. What do you guys think? So we're on the sad sap farm. We got a duck. I usually name my ducks like personally. I name them after I use I name my uh, chickens and my cows after food items, and I tend to name the ducks after um, cartoons like or characters like Howard the Duck or uh, Darkwing Duck or Launchpad because I watch that a lot. <laughs> Goose the duck. I kind of like that. <laughs> oh, we've got two people who say goose. Yes, let's just go with goose. Three gooses. Buck the duck is good. Yeah. I think that's good. Oh, I think my very first, my very first chicken, I remember this in Stardew Valley. When I played like five, six years ago or five years ago, my very first chicken, I had my child name it for me. And I think it was five at the time. He was five at the time. He named my very first chicken and we named it Kitty. <laughs> Kitty the chicken. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> but that's what it was. All right, uh, let's go check. Uh, I kind of want to see if there's any spring onions so I can like have some super stinky breath on the last day. I don't think I've shipped a spring onion. Have I? No, we haven't sold a spring onion yet, so I need at least one. Some of the names chosen for the NPCs are actual names that sound right. Oh, like Marnie, Clinton stuff. Yeah, they're, they're pretty uncommon names in the areas that I live, but... Yeah, Kitty the chicken. <laughs> and every time we pet it, because he was little at the time, I would go, meow. <laughs> I'm sure that's really confusing. What noise does the chicken make? Meow. <laughs> you named the chicken nuggets? Yeah, we have Nuggy the chicken on this farm. Which uh, which one? I'll have to I'll have to save all the pass out quotes. <laughs> we'll come up with a <laughs> we'll come up with stuff. Uh, speaking of, I do have merch on my website too. Just some fun stuff that I made. But nothing with pass outs yet. We'll work on something like that. Oh, coal for 300 gold. Ooh, a mega bomb. Actually, 250 is really good price for a mega bomb, guys. And I don't need that. I don't need that. Should I buy this mega bomb? Nah, I need the money for stuff. I need the money and stuff. Cheryl. <laughs> yeah. That word isn't as uh widely widely accepted in America as it is uh I don't know why I called it America because that's where we are at as America as, as elsewhere. Oh, if you had a Stardew Valley villager name, what would it be? You would be a penny, Lauren? I think I, I always call America America because I, I low-key make fun of my own country. I'm a terrible person. Don't do that. Don't do that. Don't do that. We're doing crops and seeds. It was what? There we go. Forage and I wanted to sell a sell some spring onions just so I could have them sold. Go like here. There. And I think I'm going to sell the silver star quality ones. There we go. Leah? Yeah. <laughs> Until you got your pigs and as truffle maker, 6,000 truffles, truffelina. <laughs> yes. 
I'll be honest. I usually name my cows bacon and uh, and ham and gosh, I just want to eat everything. Let's hug and ki kiss these chickens. Hey, chicken, 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 and duck. Yeah, ducks and chickens, rocking it. <laughs> the word stops times itself in the word. Yes, it does, right? <laughs> Um, if I was somebody, if I was a villager in Stardew Valley, who would I be? I think, um, not just the name, but the person themselves. I would, ideally, I would want to be Linus, because I would rock a beard so good. Guys, I actually made, um, for Halloween this last year, um, the kids and I dressed up as lumberjacks, because, you know, Oregon. <laughs> Also, I like to hand make all of our gifts or all of our costumes. So we were lumberjacks this year. I had some inflatable like uh, axes, okay, and flannel and beanies and everything. And then their little Halloween pails were these buckets that painted that we that uh, we painted together as a craft um, as like little stumps. So <laughs> those are not flower pots, but um, I made. I made beards out of yarn for all of us and it was it took a while but uh I gotta I gotta find a picture that doesn't have their faces in it preferably I guess it would be fine I try not to share pictures of my kids around because I'm weird like that gotta protect the children's <gasps> but I'll definitely get a picture. I'll, I'll wear the beard on stream sometime, I promise. Maybe we'll do that on the um, the unboxing. I'll have a beard stream <laughs> where I try to drink things and keep it out of my beard. <laughs> yeah, not weird, not great to talk to your sister. Nope. <laughs> uh, yes, please, ghost, give me. That was so great. This this sword is so great. Ah. Uh yeah. I know some people are a little bit more free and open about their personal lives, but I like to having kids makes me want to keep it separate as much as possible, you know. Cuz it's their choice what they want to do with their whole internet identity. In my opinion. Later, when they're older. <laughs> They have no choice now. <laughs> Their choice now is not to have one. <laughs> <gasps> Ooh, a mallet. Okay, so this dagger is awesome. But the thing about the mallet is I have animation canceling on you guys. And hammers with animation canceling is like so, so great. You can move it so much faster. I might still do the, the, um dagger a little bit you know you know put emojis and stickers or something yeah that makes sense yeah it always bothers me when I see like a uh, YouTube channels with like their kids all over the place but <laughs> that's me <laughs> I'm going to go because the sooner that we get down to um, uh, the lower levels to 80, the better. Like if we could get down to 80, that would be so great today. <laughs> I am not good with the, the mallet and the hammer. Oh yeah, I mean that makes sense. Like. My older kid, he's 15 now. If he wants to do his live streaming and stuff, that's totally fine. And if he wants to be like, hey, Wicked, he's my mom, that's fine too. That's his choice. But my older kid, my younger kid, we're just going to wait on that. Let's see, can we? Uh, I should probably just pop up real quick and do that. Hi, Meadrill. Oh, Meadrill. Miadro. I like the name. Let's drop that off and we'll do a quartz. Yeah, quartz. One, two, three, and a quartz. And then back on down. Oh, bye, pineapple. Have a good night. 
You decided to rummage through, which took your friends by surprise. <laughs> They're like, what are you doing in the trash? Wait, your real friend Jody <laughs> or in game Jody? Uh, uh, we've got, um, I'll be finishing this day at the end of the spring will be the last day of the stream. So whenever this day is over is when we're done. And then I gotta mentally prepare myself for <laughs> summertime. I was kind of hoping to have some more gold by now. But I've been kind of slacking in the mines. Ooh, sweet. I've been kind of slacking in the mines, honestly. We're just gonna have to do a bunch of watering in the beginning of the summer until we get um yes ladder until we get these sprinklers going oh i cannot wait until the the uh, what's emma called it the bathhouse opens up that's gonna be a game changer for all of like three days like the bathhouse is the one thing that I love it so much during the little bit of time that I use it, and then once I'm done using it, like I never use it again. <laughs> once I get my sprinklers, I'm like, oh, what is this place? I don't know. Who knows? Yeah. Couldn't have timed that better myself, Lavender. Well, I guess I, I was the one timing it, but. <laughs> Eat this onion. Jeez. I said yes this time. Hey, ghosty ghost, can you please give me your sparkly soul? Sp yes, gold. Yeah, I usually use it, um, depending, it just depends on when it is that I get sprinklers is, will determine when it is that I use the bathhouse, to be honest with you. Like, with this playthrough, I don't have my sprinkler set up for summer yet, so I'll be using it probably for the first week. And then once we grind enough uh, gold out, we'll be able to... Ah! We'll be able to get the sprinklers, and I won't need to go back at all. Introducing summertime. Should I sing the summer song? <laughs> Summer, summer, summertime. What is that? That's a Will Smith song, I think. Ooh, 70, sweet. What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? Master Slingshot. I forget. <laughs> I know a lot of people love using the slingshots, and that's great. I am not good with the slingshot at all. Um, We can make one of each. Boop, boop, boop. And then we'll do one of that. Cool. We'll go iron, quartz, and a gold. And oops. I guess I could do another quartz. Bloop, bloop. Like so. <laughs> yeah, I, I figured crazy wolf. I was just being silly. <laughs> Don't mind me. You went to Florida. Oh. You're simply standing in as a. <laughs> you guys are super. You you're super special. Like, add a little class to Florida. Way to go. Not that Florida isn't classy. I just hear too many stories about a uh, Florida guy. Florida guy stories. <laughs> you always get the feeling of disappointment when you see the slingshot. I'm sorry. Oh, I totally forgot that the ghosts show up in the 70s. Sweet, we got a ghost fish. Yay. Now, give me a bone sword. That would be pretty cool. Although I don't know if um, this dagger might be better than the bone sword. See, look how fast the mallet is with the animation canceling. It's pretty great. My animation canceling skills are <laughs> leave a lot to be desired. Oh yeah, Dara, absolutely. Although some people will still use that um, method, the, the older method of the slingshot because it's what they're used to. And I get it. 
Like muscle memory is muscle memory, you know. Uh, let's do boop, 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 boop. smash, smash, smash. <laughs> uh, go away. <gasps> no, they're not the bats. Oh. Kind of hoping for some more gold from these ghosties. Not having much luck yet. Ah! 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 Go away! Ah! Go away! Go away! Go away! Back! Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Go away! Thank you. Um, how are we gonna get over there? Go boop boop, and there we go. Sweet, perfect. I'm just gonna go. You know what? Whatever. Can I make it to level 75? I know I'm not gonna be able to make it. I don't think I'm gonna be able to make it to level 80, but if we can just get to level 75, I'd be like super happy with that, you know? And um, it's okay that I'm not really selling a ton of stuff overnight because we can sell stuff t straight to Pierre tomorrow. And I'm probably gonna honestly buy all of my Let's eat this crystal fruit or we'll eat the, the winter root. I feel like I get those more. Um, I'm going to buy probably buy my seeds from Joja Mart tomorrow because of them being cheaper. And I'm feeling like a cheapy cheaper person right now. I need my money for other things. At least I got a duck. That's good. Actually, yeah, I feel like I accomplished a lot of good things today. We got a duck or on stream today. We got a duck. We got... um. The dino egg is in the works. Oh my gosh, can we... I don't want to eat this because it's already one o'clock. I'm not going to make it to 75. Like, am I? I guess we'll eat this spring onion. I was saving the gold star spring onion to gift to... Um, to gift to Linus because it's gold star. Oh, sweet. Can I make one more ladder? One more ladder. Come on. I think I almost left. There's a skeleton. So maybe he'll give us a ladder. Hey, Bone Buddy. Ladder, please. Nope. Darn it. And I got snow bombs. Snow bombs. Um. Your friend found you asking the character to dance at the flower festival. <laughs> Yeah, did they accept? There's a glitch on your tablet. Oh. It spawns a twin of them. Oh, I've seen I've seen pictures of that. That's so weird. Yeah, we're not gonna make it. <laughs> Unless by some off chance, like this one's the ladder. Nope. Maybe this one? It's totally fine if we get overexerted. I'm leveling up. Am I? No. No! No! My swagger walk <laughs> and pass out. <laughs> Oops. Uh, yay! Pass out time! And level up in farming, so at least the first day of summer is going to be full of energy. <laughs> Goodness. Ah! <laughs> and level 6 of foraging. So that's good. We're gonna get some lightning rods before the first day of summer. Oh, and hopefully by the first, um, the first lightning storm. Okay, so we've got 2,400 gold and I had like about, around about 300 gold. That's definitely not enough for all of the seeds that we need. So I'm going to have to do, um, some stuff and sell some things, um, plan what we need. But I don't want to overwater everything, but I do want to get, make a lot of money from farming in the summertime. So I'm going to have to strategize. I usually like to have about 12,000 gold at the beginning. All I have to do is make like 10 tea saplings. Oh, 20 tea saplings and then we'll be good. <laughs> I made it to bed only once this stream. <laughs> oh my gosh, seriously. Oh goodness. I hit okay. <sighs> well, that's going to be it for today. Oh my gosh. Didn't realize my light was so low too. Light.
No. <laughs> there, there's my face. <laughs> well, well, we passed out like every day. I'm told that I didn't pass out once. <laughs> One time we got to bed. <laughs> wow, I feel I feel special. <laughs> Mistakes were made, but also it's okay. It's gonna be a new season. There's gonna be a lot of stuff going on. And then I'm gonna work on getting some uh something fun planned so we can do a little unboxing video sometime this week. That'll be good. I hope y'all have a chill rest of your Sunday. I'm gonna go start making some um dinner for the kids. It's 4.30 here. I don't know what we're going to make today. It's usually pasta or something. I forgot. Oh, thanks for coming in, Nani. Thanks, Average Hat Cat. Bye. Bye, Rain. Bye, Nicole. Bye, Chubby Panda. <laughs> Bye, Gray. <laughs> now I'm going to go pass out in real life. Oh, Sundays. <laughs> we can have Sundays for dinner. Yeah. And maybe a Sunday, Sunday stream. <laughs> All right. Bye.